Did. Is that why you want to end yourself in prison? Eh? You can sign prison, you can sign this our sign fight. <laughs> eh? When you can sign prison, you can sign our fight. See this one. So you don't know, say, if I not come that time, why I come? Either one of them or two go die and life imprisonment now your portion. You don't know. Go for beat. I jump and pass. No need go die for prison. Now them, their parents, all the family members, all of them go die for prison. You see this fight? Yeah. It never end. Anywhere where I see them, we will continue this fight. That's not my life day. That's not your life day. Why see them? We will continue this fight. That's not your life day. She have told you to stop fighting. Eh? Stop fighting, especially with boys. Why do you want to put your auntie Amarachi in trouble? Why? Jaka, why? He consigned you. He consigned you, Auntie Rapu. No put my auntie name for this matter. Mm. No put her name for this matter. Make her no insult you, Joy. Ah? What if you all say? If I don't catch this, this idiot way you should come up for this person, I will come back for you. Make a just go and know that they still want crazy with Oh, you still want fight? Chaka. Yes. Why? Where? Yeah. Yeah. I just saw them on my way back from school. They're yeah. fighting. Oh, this girl. Please, come and show me. Come and yeah. show me where they're fighting. No, this girl will not kill me. Nobody beats me. In fact, me, I fight them. What did we fight? I know be nobody beats me now. Oh, will you stop that rubbish? Were you fighting with some boys or not? I they fight. In fact, what did we fight, Safe? What did we fight? I beat them. I beat if I say fight, go be like say would they play. I beat them. Them connect where where. Okay, now what did this useless idiot can't tell you say and they fight? I mean they call idiot. Just take time, oh man, no entire for you. Eh? Why ain't I day, Chris? Why make I? Are you talking about you shut up your mouth? How many times have I want you to stop fighting? How many times? Eh? Is something wrong? Is something wrong with with, me, me, with me, this me, your me. head? Is something wrong with your head? Fight, fight. Um, Emeka, thank you, eh? You you can go home, oh? Thank you. Let me cannot slap you now. Let me cannot slap you. Oh yeah, go back to the house. No worry. Go to the yeah, house now. Go to the house Baby, please, take it easy. You're hurting yourself. And this is not good for your health. Please. What do you want me to do? Ichaka has become a bone stuck to my throat. I can't swallow it and I can't spew without. I am the only relation she has. Will I abandon her? No, baby. No one is saying you should abandon her. All I am saying is that you should start seeing things from the positive side. Mm. Believe me, to get better. Why? What have I not done for Ichaka? I dropped out of school because of her. It's not like I'm complaining because it's all thanks to you. I completed school at the Open University. So, 
Why can't Ichaka, why can't she let me have peace of mind? Why can't she give me a breathing space? Baby, please stop. Stop crying because it hurts so much for me to see you cry. Believe me, she will change. With time, she will change. She's just a kid. Just a kid. You and I know that Ichaka is 16. The fact that she's taunted girl doesn't make her a kid. She's not. She's supposed to be in SS3 or SS2. But she's in JS3. Causing trouble. Fighting every now and then. Causing havoc. Why? <laughs> Do you even know what she told me? What did she tell you? That school is not her calling. That she wants to start hawking. She wants to start hawking. But, but baby, <laughs> don't you think you should put that into consideration? Maybe she's right. Maybe school is not her calling. How do you mean? How can school not be her calling? How? It's not as if she does badly in her exams. Ichaka is smart and intelligent. But the point is that she doesn't even sit for exams. Leonard, you don't know that girl. That girl is full of mischief. Baby, look. Listen, listen. Look at me. Look at me. I'm here for you. For us. Everything will be fine. Believe me. Come here. 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 Who are you greeting? It is good I met you here. What is good about this sibling? No, no, no. What is good about this sibling? Look at what that's your old banjay niece. See to my son. Eh? See, just take a look at my son. Please. Please, I beg you. Say her to stay away from my son. They are not age mates. Say her. Please. It is because of the wickedness of your sister and her husband that made God to punish her with that evil girl. Say her to stay away from my son. Do you hear me? Or do she want to kill my son the way she killed her parents? Mama Ako, eh? How can you say such words about my late sister and her husband? Abba, it's not fair. Then what is fair? Is it this thing that she did to my son that is fair? No, tell me. Let me just warn you for the last time. You better go and buy shame and shame that thing. Do you hear me? Better shame that your dog. Because the next time it steals towards my territory, I am going to kill it. Nonsense! Mama Ako, you need to mind the kind of things you say now, eh? You need to mind what you say when you're angry. I'm, I'm so sorry, okay? But you just need to calm down. Just need to calm down. No, I'm, let her come, come, come close to my phone again. Nonsense. Every day trouble. I've not even gotten home. Yeah. And I met Mama Ago on my way. You need to see the way Ichaka dealt with her son. Hey! You need to see the way she was lamenting. How bitter she was. Hey! This girl will not kill me. She won't. I pray Hawking will, Hawking will help her stop fighting. I pray. Eh? Because I was one that freed, freed those guys from her grip. She, I'm telling you, she was even boasting that the fight will continue. Do you know, I don't know where Ichaka gets the strength from. I don't know where she gets the strength to fight two boys at a time. Eh? I heard that there were a lot of, a lot of them all, but some ran away. Hmm. Eh? You know, according to her, she said fighting is her talent. Mm -hmm. Yes, but the problem is that, you know, selling her karam bread, if it's not sold in a day, it will get spoiled. My dear, it doesn't even have to be a caram bread. Mm -hmm. Even if it's to sell pure water or mineral, anything at all. Let her just hug, since she said that's her calling. Let <laughs> her do it. But please, I, I will beg you. I need you to help me watch and guide her. Oh, Pico. Everything is a chakra's calling, apart from school. Yes, except school. But 
Please, I have heard what you said. I might not be able to tolerate her excesses. Please, warn her. I can see. Thank you very much. Hmm? I will warn her when we get home. I will warn her. Oh, thank you. All right, no problem. You want to take it? He's such an embodiment of virtue. An amazing soul. <sighs> he may not be financially rich, but he's not freaked by wealth. That's a real man. Yes. He has a wealthy character. I mean, every man in this village will do anything to get me smile at them. He's so smart to have coded all the advances I made at him, despite how innocent I made it look. Oh. Lord, I'm falling in love with this guy. I mean, won't I appear crazy to be dying for him? Ah, no, 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 Lord. Oh Lord, I think I'm falling in love with this guy. Won't it appear crazy that I'm dying for him? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. I mean, he may not be physically big, but he's mentally and spiritually a giant after all i'm not crazy no i'm not mm. Mm -mm. i'm not i mean i like him yeah Someone's face is obviously bright today. <laughs> How are you, my love? I'm fine. Come here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come here. Mm -hmm. How are you? Fine. You look sharp. 
Thank you. You were right. Oh. Mm -hmm. So hey, what's up? Do you know you were right? Right about what? The hawking business I told you Chaka wanted to start. She has started it already. Wow. And since she started this business, Ichaka has not fought with anyone for one week now. Baby, <laughs> this is some good news. Yes. I, I, I told you, I told you that Hawking is actually a talent. And not only that, she makes approximately 100% interest on everyday sales. Wow. Like she is really taking this business seriously. Baby, are you for <laughs> real? You know what? Let's just keep it going that way. I believe with time, she will redirect the energy to education, believe me. <sighs> you know, I, I told you that she will get better, right? I hope so, and I pray so. I'm so happy. I'm so happy that you're one happy. one week, I have respect. I'm happy. At don't worry, point, like, don't worry. I, I told you she will change. I told you. I know so. Um, babe, guess what? What? I got something for you. You did? Yes. What did you get for me? Just wait. <laughs> um, close your eyes. Okay. Close okay, your okay. eyes. It's closed. Okay. Mm. Make sure you don't open it. Okay. Fine. What did you get? <laughs> what did I guess? Don't guess. You can open your eyes, baby. What's that? <laughs> Maybe you should check it out. Perfume. I know you like it. Oh, thank here. you. Mm. I love it. Mm. I love you, babe. I love you. I love you. I love you. Too. I want you to be happy. <laughs> I'm always happy with you. I cut on my face, my nose, my ears. It's too bad in the morning for my mom. For my mom. For my mom. Going again with that gallon. I thought you said the other one was the last one. Yeah, Do you want to kill yourself with work? But I found out that this one cannot fill the drum, so let me just when you want to blame and fit it just now. Mm -mm, mm -mm, no way, no way. The one you have fetched is enough for us for today because rest. I don't want you to go out without eating. Go inside and eat, oh no. Well, I'm not killing myself now. You do not take like let me just go and fetch this and then come back and relax. I'm not killing myself with work. And on a normal self, is a normal house chores. And also my duty as a son to do chores for my mother. Nothing do they do, nothing they do. Now. I mean, what could I have done in this life without you? Eh? My life would have been miserable without you in my life. Oh, no. Nah. Well, no, they aren't this kind thing. No, they aren't that kind thing. I don't tell you, they know me, you know, they aren't this kind thing. Now you give me, now you give me warm that night. If not for you, hunger for why be what you know good? It's not just the... Their life by now, so. It's just divine providence. Eh? My son, I thought we agreed that you will not be speaking that bad English again. Ah, my Lenovers, now her condition keep me this morning. I make her bring out my street language. No, say now her condition make her fish then. I don't matter. Come, 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 go and eat. Come. Could I have done without this girl? His presence in my life 
brought me so much joy and comfort. If not, my life would have been miserable. But I'm scared. I'm scared that I will lose him one day. My dear sister, I am very happy. Honestly, I can't thank you enough. You have really transformed Ichaka's life. Do you know that all Ichaka talks about now is my market, business, and money? No more fights. That's the only thing she talks about. <clears throat> my sister, I'm equally surprised though. If you see the joy and energy she puts in in selling her things, eh? Hey! <laughs> hey, where? Hey, hey, I was going to ask. Why, why is it that she's not selling one thing? Today, she will sell pure water. Tomorrow, mineral. Another day, a different thing. Like today now, she's selling egg and buns. <laughs> so why can't she just stick to one, one market? Yeah? Uh, I don't understand. My dear sister, market is as it favors you. The good thing is that she sells everything she bought in a day. Yes. Okay, I guess you're right. Mm -hmm. Because she's really making gains from it. And she's making money. Ah. But I'm worried. Worried about what? I'm worried that she may go back to this uh, fighting lifestyle. Also, she's supposed to be in school, not this hawking. Yeah. Amara, you don't have to be worried. Eh? You, be, you should be thanking God that this uh, hawking business has helped her stop bringing you high BP. Eh? You don't have to be worried. Yes, now, because according to her, she said this uh, hawking is her calling. I don't think it will allow her to go back to her fighting in the streets. You think so? I think so. Because if you see the joy and energy, I think she has stopped already for her to be hawking in the street, not fighting, thinking that you, for how long have you not shouted, Ajaka, stop fighting? How long? She's enjoying her business. Oh, my friend, you're really trying for Ajaka. Thank you. What eh? are friends for? You know, my friend. Ah, what I would do for sister, I would do for you. Yes, that's yes. the market. Okay. All right, dear. You are sweet, Akara. Listen, Evelyn. Don't think you can blackmail my emotion. I am not a fool. I know exactly what you're doing. Are you for real? Why on earth are men like this? Why is it hard to find a responsible guy who is not a cheat? And the worst is, they will be so proud of their stupidity. Listen, I know your antics, but I promise you this time, you won't get a dime from me. What stupid antics are you talking about? I am talking of your constant visit to village, leaving your business behind. Do not swear. Swear you're not visiting the village to see a girl. And what right do you have to question me? Answer me. What right do you have to question me when I visit the village and when I choose to leave? Let me advise you. You better go and face your sugar daddy and leave me alone. What? Are you boldly accusing me of cheating on you? Deny. No, deny it. You think I don't know. You think I don't know that you've been sleeping around? You stupid fool. Stop it! Stop it, Leonard. How dare you? How dare you, Leonard? How dare you call me names? Oh, Did you just slap me? And I will do it again and again if you try this nonsense. Oh, this is confirming my suspicions. With no regards to my feelings, I will deal with you and that your bitch. Get out. Stupid. Get out. We are done. Get out. Fool.
to no effects now, no effects. I don't know, say this thing will make you cry like this. I mean, you just say, if I fight, finish, say, if I come back, you go clap for me. Mm. Oh, say, I defend myself now. We can clap for you. Eh? Say, you defend yourself. Ichaka, what evil did I commit? What evil did I commit to have you as a niece? Why can't I have one month peace of mind? Why? Because I have you as a niece. It's my fault. It's my fault. No, not my fault. Let me see now your fault too. The fight is not be between me and Onyema. Me, I try to do my own fight. Onyema carrying some stupid stuff. Come, person by me ego. Person by ego. Come pay for only boss. Already you don't chop the egg roll. Come on, the time you say, now small egg they sell. Say you go pay for semi semi egg roll and semi boss. Say what you happen now? Yeah. I think I'm sharp sharp. Probably say not my fault. Must you fight? Ichaka, must you fight? Everything about you, fight, fight, fight. Can't you call people around to help you settle the matter? No. Anybody yeah. go do any help to collect any help. Yeah. 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 Call anybody. As I as I beat them, now so stupid on him I enter. Me I beat them join now. Yeah, talk for yourself. As you don't give everybody moto moto. Have you seen yourself? Now see what see what they've done to you. See the injury you've done to yourself. Have you seen it? Not only me carrying injury. Last night all of us carrying injury. All of us carrying injury go home. He me collect. He only only me collect me. I collect. But make on him and not say this fight never ends. Because anyway, why I catch on him? Two of us will dig out and out. May watch and see. Just, 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 just shut up your mouth. So you still want to fight in this condition? Ichaka, you still want to fight? Hey! No, I know that you don't like yourself. You don't like yourself at all. Are you possessed with a fighting spirit? Eh? Is it quite okay? Are you alright? Hey, hey, this girl, you will not kill me. Oh. You will not kill me. You hear me? You will not kill me. Continue. Go and fight. Let them kill you. Babe, what the hell is wrong with you? How can you slap a full grown man in public? If he had beaten you up now, you would call him a girlfriend beater. You would dare not. Did you hear me? He will not try it. If he tries it, I will show him the stuff I'm made of. How dare he call me names? How dare he call me a loose girl? Don't know that I will fire that guy. Don't know that I will fire him. Hmm? Now, but that grace today. In as much I don't support the words he used on you. But you know he's right. He said it out of provocation and frustration. Luz, listen, if you don't love him, let him go. Let him live his life in peace. We both know you don't even love him. Saint Quinet, you know that is not possible. And let me tell you, if I find out you are the one furnishing him with doings about me in this city, eh? I will make life miserable for you. Then you know hold me. your side. Hold your side. Do you think he's daft? With the type of treatment you've meted on him, who wouldn't know that you're seeing multiple men? Hmm. Don't just use your own to spoil his own, please. If you don't love him, leave him alone. Let him live his life in peace, please. Hmm. Let me ask you. If I was dating only Leonard, if Leonard was the only man in my life, how do you think I'm going to afford all this lifestyle I'm living? From you, obviously not, because I know you don't have shishin. Evelyn, whatever you do, leave him alone. Enjoy your multiple men in peace. Leave him to live his life, please. The way I'm looking at you, the way I'm looking at you, Queenness, the way I'm looking at you, eh? Let me just investigate and find out you know something. As you're the one giving Leonard information because this is your sudden empathy for him. This is your sudden empathy for him. Let me find out. God, you're impossible. Let me just find out you have a nine minutes. You know me. You know me. You know me. I don't get joy. Mm. 
sorry. Come here, son. When did you even become a troublemaker to fight to this extent? Eh? Uh, my mother told me, is that foolish girl? I saw her beating one of my friends, so I have to beat her very, very well. Wait, oh. did I hear you say a girl? You mean you fought a girl because of another girl? Me, how can I do that? She was actually fighting a guy. Yes. And the way I put her, she wanted to beat me too. Although it was a tough fight between me and her, but I dealt with her. I'm sure that the stuff I'm made of. Don't know. I told you. Oh. Beating a girl is not good for your character. You shouldn't be beating a girl. It ain't nothing. Promise me you will never lay a finger on a woman again. Eh? It's a man. Okay. I must. I must. I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise. Mama, I promise. Mama, I promise. I promise. I promise. I will never be dumb, but if you open eye for me, you should go collect. Go collect, eh. Otto. Okay. No, she will not collect. She will not collect, Mama. She will not collect. Ay, ay, Mama. Mama. I don't understand. I'm seriously tired. I don't know what else to do. I don't know. Eh? I don't know what else to do. I'm tired. Baby, you don't have to be tired. I believe with time, she'll get better. When? When and how? Tell me. Eh? Just look at what we are celebrating that she has changed. Now look at what she just did. Eh? When, when, when will Ichaka, when will she change? When? But babe, I wanted to look at this from her own side too. She said someone bought something from her and refuses to pay. Then someone else stepped in and fight. I mean, what would you have her do? Fold her hands and watch? Baby, listen. She did the right thing. Why are you always on her side? Why? Why are you always taking her sides? Maybe you should come to the house and see her face. This person really dealt with her. Eh? Okay, okay. What do you want us to do? What's the plan? I'm begging you. Let us come to the city and stay at your house. Maybe if I start work, she can go back to school. You, look, I believe a change of environment will help her a lot. It will help her. Baby, that would have been a good idea, a very good one, if there is a place for you guys in the city. But for now, my place is not conducive enough. Is there something I should know? Are you hiding anything from me? No. What do you mean? I don't know because anytime the issue of me coming to your house in the city, you get really uncomfortable. Even if it's just to visit. Where are you going to with your box? I'm sure you obviously you know what me to tell me. You want me to tell you, so you start preaching that you are holier than your son. Never reach like that now. Eh? You know that I always advise you. But it's still up to you to take it or you leave it. Most times you end up doing what is on your mind. Eh? Well, let me tell you, since you're my friend. I noticed that it's because I moved out of Leonard's house. That's what gave him the God to be bringing lots of women in his house. So I'm moving back to his house. Hmm. Please leave. Are you serious or you're joking? How do you know? I know, not a small girl. And I ask you again, how do you know he brings girls to his house? 
if you carry your box and move your things to his house, do you think you still have the freedom to be going out to see other men? Or do you think men will be able to visit you in his house? Think it though. <laughs> you know, sometimes eh, I wonder if you're truly my friend. Yes, because if you are my friend, if you know me well, you should know that Evelyn knows how to coordinate things. I will coordinate myself in his house. Coordinator, you have forgotten that that was the reason why you ran away from his house to my place. Have you forgotten that? And you know that you slapped him the other day. So how do you think he will even allow you into his house? It's true. Why? And he might even wake up one night and choke me to death. You've seen it now. Oh, but my friend, what do I do now? I can't just hold my hand and allow him dump me like that. Evelyn, you cannot move to his house. Eh? Sometimes I even wonder if everything is alright with you. Please come back inside so he will not kill you. Please, give me your box. Are you trying to say I'm the problem? Don't go anywhere, my friend. I will not allow you to do that. Huh? Ah. You might have to allow me. We need money in this house before hunger will wire somebody. Hunger will not do anything to us. You think I'm not strong enough? I'm strong enough to go back. So. I know you are strong enough, but as one of the house, I need to hustle first. Make a hustle first. No business today. Today now, Kung Fu and Karate Taekwondo Day. If I slap you, eh? Ijaka, if I slap you, what's the meaning of this rubbish? This is not be any rubbish, oh. This is not be any rubbish. I don't want what happened now last time it happened again. I don't want them. You see this iron on here, man? You go learn in lesson. I don't want them. See, eh, if I open my eyes and you have not disappeared from this place, mm. what I will do to you, eh? What do you, you go do? No allow me give you my fucking nekito. No allow me. Okay, yeah, still talking. I fucking nekito. Okay, wait. Ijaka, wait for me. Jebi, you. Go, go, go. Do your own. Go, 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 go. Go. Do your business. Okay, you see. Chai. <laughs> play, 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 play. Babe, can't you own, can't you own? Babe, the way that you have been talking about Leonard lately, it's obvious that you follow for him, oh. but you're just forming Queen Latifah. <sighs> Babe, play, oh. make I not go win you now, you go say now because you're the gist now, why you know they play? Mm -hmm. The last time I checked, my name no be Queen. <laughs> hey. See, you just did divert this talk, oh. I, now it's obvious that you actually love him. But well, you don't let your ego ruin things for you. You say you're rich. And now you don't hold me for where I know if you escape. Ah, oh, yes. I love Leonard. Mm. And I don't know what to do. I'm confused. Babe, nothing is wrong with you. Your heart has been telling you genuinely that you're in love. What every woman needs now is to find genuine love, not to go about multiple men. 
Yeah, I agree with you. Leonard is so nice and kind. But I feel I have offended him so much that I don't even know how to, to go about it. I don't know if he will accept me back if I should change and turn a new leaf. Babe, that depends on how you go about it. You have to stoop to conquer. You know you're so intelligent. Eh? If person they look you, eh? you don't know if you wish too. If person they look you with your innocent face. If person go to say you don't know anything. You don't go to say you be bad. <laughs> you know I always got your back. What are that friends for? Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Just do what I said. I will. I will right. play. Thank you. I don't the way you. Ah! <laughs> Okay. I play. So we meet for this game. Ah! <laughs> Bring on! It's a key checker. It's a key checker. no It's a key checker. Answer your call, I call on the definition. Answer your call, everything I call. It's a come where we are. I call on the definition. Answer your call, everything I call. Hey, what is going on? I never see comfortable before. No, I never see you. It's a car. Why have you not been coming to sell? So you are totally fine. Eh? See me. Ha! I think it. I don't know say people, people wicked like this. Even if you say I they see you like my madam. I will say you your head no correct. I don't go talk am. So you see they pray for me, make I say carry plaster, they walk up and down. Make I know fine by now. Ah, ah, they wish me well, oh. They wish me well, oh, for our own good, oh. For our own good, oh. You know, that's not what I meant. Okay, tell me. Why have you not been coming to see oh. Change of calling. I don't change calling. Maybe say I don't forget the walking calling, oh. That will never go. But. I don't want to make what happened the last time make it happen again. I don't want to make anybody defeat me. Nobody will try. Chuck, are you okay? Are you sure you're okay? I'm okay. The fact over okay, they worry me. Okay, one do come. <laughs> Karat, uh, kill me. Now only you want to do all those things. Remain, no. Make you no go die, yo. Remeno, you're supposed to be resting by now, sir. So you be strong enough. And who told you I'm not strong enough? I told you not to go out, and you disobeyed me. Why? Uh, as the man of the house, and I have to house, and Mama Lok shine on me today. I need three thousand. I will not touch that money until you tell me the source. How did you get the money to start up that business? No, I've been forgotten that one that dashed me water the floor, scoring two gold in my mouth. That's when I used to start off my business last week. Huh? Eh? Yeah. 
How much is this? Three thousand something. You used one thousand, and you made two thousand. Three thousand. Eh? One mm. day. Yes, my dad. I told you, Lord, sign on me today. What shall I do? I just need one thousand. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Mama, I go and rest. Let me make enough money for today. So. Okay, my son. We need tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Right, let's go now. Nobody knows tomorrow. Onye mazi echi. He brought the joy and comfort to mama. What could mama have done without you? Onye mazi echi. You saved mama from the shame. Look, you don't have to apologize to me. Yes, because you've done nothing wrong. It's your choice. But I've also chosen that we have to define what we have in this relationship. Baby, what are you saying? What? What have I not done to prove my love for you? I don't deny the fact that you, you are providing my needs. But I cannot be in a relationship that's built on lies. I cannot. Babe, what are you saying? Built on lies? Yes. Yes. When you hide things from me, what do you call it? Eh? And I want to know that thing that you're hiding that makes you not want me to come and visit you. Leonard, what is it? What are you hiding? Baby, come on. That I don't want you to visit me yet doesn't mean I'm hiding things from you. Maybe I'm trying to protect you, but I need you to understand with me. Are you being serious right now? I see. You know what? I appreciate everything you've done for me. I appreciate you for being there for me. But you see, from now on, I will start fending for myself and my needs. Maybe, just maybe, when the time is ripe, then we will know which way forward in this relationship. That's if it still exists. No, 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 baby, 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 wait. Baby, I, I mean, listen, listen, babe, I, I love you, okay? I love you, and I am not cheating. Hello? Hello? Hello, babe? Respond to my greetings. Yes. See, I've realized my mistakes, and that's why I'm here to say sorry. I seriously do not know what came over me. Yes. Really? You came to say sorry? You must have grown so much balls to come to my house to say sorry. I'm so sorry. Don't you dare! Oh! Get close to me! Are you mad? Let me have my keys! Let me have my keys! Okay? What are you doing? Where's my keys? Evelyn, where are my keys? Now listen, next time I'll see your two left legs in my house, I swear to God, I will kill you. Now, get out! Get out! Get out! Babe. Na narrow escape I do today. I've never seen Leo this angry since I met him. Now today I know say that guy na lion as the name implies. He nearly choked me to death. But baby, you know say you fuck up. You went to do something else after I've already told you what to do. Don't you doubt? Do you think that someone will be enticed by you? 
Now you see where it has gotten you. Will you blame me? I thought maybe as a young guy now, if he sees succulent body, that his mind will come down. I didn't even know that the thing will help and bring out the beast in him. All men have beasts that rear its head once they are pushed to the wall. Babe, you have to do what I told you if you really want to get his heart again. Huh? Are you sure it will work? Because from what I saw, you are not there now. It's me that will tell you what happened. From what I saw, mm, eh, me, I'm even very scared to go close to Leo. I've told you. Just do what I said. Then thank me later. You have to. Stop that thing you're doing. See, I want us to talk. Calm down. My money will be to send me money for that matter. See, they do my training. If I finish, you go flog me. I know you're not flogging. You go flog me if I finish. After I'll flog in there for the training. So calm down, make her finish. And who is talking about flogging? Eh? Who said I want to flog you? Come, I want us to talk business. Yes. yes. You mean I? And what kind of business? See, I want to join you in this your hawking business. Hey, so that we can make more money and more gains. Makes sense. Makes yeah, sense. Makes sense. sense. But you just end up with one the one we make you use sex trap for me. Jack. I'm serious so mm. I am dead serious. I want to join your hawking business now. So that anybody that wants to look for your job, and you run to me and I will cover you. Makes sense. Makes, Makes sense. sense. Yeah. In fact, take five. You try. You try. Oh, yeah. Stop this thing you're doing. Enter. Uh-uh. You go enter. You go I know business. you will like this one. I like them now. I need to know the business. Piam. I go enter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nah. You don't say this your IJ now. Nah. You go give me courage. You know, like, they do this my kung fu way. Do one way. Do one. So that if anybody enter, you know, go cross out. You understand? <laughs> You will not go and look for something better to do. Mm. This early morning, look at the look at what you're doing. Now training, training. Make a strong go. Make a strong for you and me. Okay. I go strong for me and you. You and I. Now what are they do? This is serious. This girl has never acted this way towards me since I knew her. I must have really wronged her. All because of this crazy Evelyn. If I lose Amara, I swear to God I will so deal with you evil Evelyn. It's a promise. I'll deal with you. So 
Oh, this might be the magic. Baby, you never think positive about good things, eh? You be thinking all those nonsense ideas. That's the only thing you be thinking about. This is very fine. Mm -hmm. To go. Mm -hmm. It will go. It never, never reached to insult me. To go. You know. I just wish this will work out. Because I can't wait to have Leonard back. <laughs> you know you're talking about this, Leonard. I feel like other guys only bring light for you again. Because who maybe understand you again? See, it's not about other guys. After our last discussion, like both of us, I thought about it and I came to conclusion that Leonard is really a nice guy. And he's responsible too. And age is normal on my side, so I need to settle down. <laughs> Did you not say settle down? You want to marry? Ha! This is becoming more serious than I thought to. Evelyn. <laughs> of course I need to settle down. I've been no one do Ashebi. You know one do Ashebi? I need to settle down. Voila. I finally give up. Anything you want, God go do her for you. Amen. Settle down. <laughs> yeah, I can't afford to do this. <laughs> <laughs> These are really beautiful. Mm. Oh, it's fine, right? Very fine. Very fine. Ooh. Chaka the village fighter. When they get tired, they turn. Every day from one trouble to another, you know they get tired, they turn. Hot the body in a strong. Hey, Chimo. <gasps> Something is obviously wrong with this girl. I no longer believe her problem is ordinary. Eh? So this is the reason she refused to follow me to the market. Okay. I know what to do. I know what to do. Training kit.
not sanctify. Hey! Hey, but what am I going to do now? Try it. Oh, I'm feeling bad though. Eh? Don't worry. When I buy you another one, eh? You will sanctify that one now. Eh? Eh? How am I supposed to know? Let me take this one now. It is very sweet, though. You don't want to eat. It's very sweet, though. did I do to you that you're coming back by this time? What if something had happened to you on the way? What do you think would have been my fate? Well, what did I do now? Why are you talking like this? You're coming back by this time of the night and you're asking me what you did? Eh? Do you want to kill me? I told you. But the man we are doing a council went to the police station and didn't even return quick. So I've had to wait for him so I can do account for him. You know what? From this night, no more business for you. I am strong enough to continue my own. That one will sustain us. Biko, Biko, Biko. Carry a boma. Carry this thing inside. Go and eat. Take your bath and eat, Biko. So you give me BP. Go inside now. Well, come, let's go inside. Let's go in together.
I think I am taking this too far. He has been trying to explain, but I won't even let him. But what will he even explain? I am sure he's double dating. That is why he won't want me to get close to his place. Why will he keep it from me all this while? That is deception. <sighs> why can't there be one good man on earth? But how, how are you sure he's double dating? Whatever. I think I should be serious with starting up with business. Instead of depending on a man. If a chaka can do it, I will do better. Girl, wise up. <sighs> Look at how my friend is sleeping peacefully. And I'm here rolling my eyes like a roller coaster. Evelyn, you more that sleep because of a man. Is it worth it? No. Is it worth it? I was never like this. What happened to me? Age. I guess age happened to you. You have fallen in love so deep. Is it love or jealousy? Whatever it is, what you need now is to focus. Focus on the man you love and how to grab him to yourself. And let no one steal my happiness. Yes, I will go for my man. I will go for my peace of mind. Chaka committed this time that you, you came to say that I couldn't say discuss over the phone. My friend, it has nothing to do with Chaka. Yes. I um I want to start this hockey business with you. I want to start earning money. Since I can't go to the city to look for a job because of a chaka. Well, that, that's so sacrificial of you, but do you think hockey will be the best for you? You know, say as they look at this to be a G, a G bottle. That's why you find yourself in this village. Yes, now. Which can you hear a bottle with that one? Eh? A G bottle will hunger, won't kill. That one, a G bottle. See, my friend, I need to have financial freedom. Eh? I don't want to be depending on a man for money or anything. I want to have my own money. Eh? Um, you're right, Shia. Yeah. But I think uh, it would be more dignifying if you find a shop and, you know, stay, stay there, stay from there. It's going to be better. That's the problem. Where do I get the money to rent a shop and start a business? I don't have money. See, my friend, you don't need to worry. My sister had a shop in the market. Okay. And she left it for the city mm. as her husband commands. So all you need to do is go there. For the business, you need to collect from the suppliers, yeah. then pay them after sales. Mm -hmm. Are you serious? Yes, now. Hi, thank you. Dear. <laughs> You're such a good friend. You're welcome, darling. You're welcome. Yeah. God punish you. Don't you dare. Don't try call me again and say this rubbish. Stupid man. You're a fool. Yes, I said it. You're a fool. Nonsense. Don't try it again. How about babe? That was too harsh. Who 
was that? What was too harsh? Don't you dare tell me it was too harsh again. When you don't even know who called and why he called. As much as I suspected he was using something on me. Why would he call me this morning of all mornings? What actually happened? What did he do? Who was that? Did he know that stupid uh, 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 Jerry? That fool! You know, everything was going just fine between Leo and I. And other of my men, when he came into my life, boasting and with his fake promises. That was how I found myself doing everything he wanted me to do till date. What did he do to deserve this insult you're heaping on him now? What has he done? He has done everything and I've warned him to stay away from me, stay away from anything that concerns me. Since I found out he was living a borrowed life. Can you imagine? He called me to tell me that I should stay away from Leonard, that I'm doing everything to impress him. Jesus Christ. How did he know? Did you tell him anything? I told him nothing. I didn't tell him anything. I suspected that guy was fetish and that was why I left him. But this time around, he's not going to get away with it. I will show him that I'm worried and being combined together. again you're obviously looking for something and today you must get it what are you doing here Leonard, Leonard, come on stop and bend you this time i told you i am sorry why is the angry with you you are sorry i said what are you doing in my house i don't want you here so what are you doing here <sighs> okay <laughs> i got you something thank you a gift. So you think you can get me with that your pretentious gestures? Huh? You really think I'm stupid? See, I'm not to tell you. Alright? I said I am sorry. In the bottom of my house. I am sorry. Please send this to my friend. Really? Please. 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 I'm surprised though. I mean, this is unlike you. So can I can I see them? <laughs> you are very stupid. Oh my god. Will you get this chick clothes and get the hell out of my house? I said, get out! Get this chick out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out of my house this minute! Get out! Get this thing out of my house! Okay? You think I'm stupid? You think I'm stupid? Get these things out of my house!
Did it? Ah, thank my God. It worked. I, 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 I've, I've been standing here waiting for you. What have you been waiting for, sir? Okay, actually, it's about Amara. I know she has mentioned you a few times because of your role in Chaka's life. I've not been able to reach them. Please help me. Please. Uh, but sir, why do you have to wait until I pass by? Don't you know their heart? Or better still call her on phone. Yeah, I... I've called her a couple of times, but she's not picking my calls. Please help me. Where can I find her, please? I don't know, sir. That means you've done something wrong to her. Sorry, I can't help you. No. Excuse me. Njide. Njide Biko. Please wait now, please. Bib, what actually happened to you? Did he throw you out? Queenette, I have never been humiliated in my entire life the way I was humiliated today. Did you give him the gift? He doesn't like them. I gave him the gifts and he threw them away. Of course, you don't expect me to go pick the gifts. See, let me tell you what happened. As expected, he was furious at first. But when I tried to calm him down, see if we can talk things out, I, I, I tried to give him the gift. Mm -hmm. Then he, he was surprised that I could think of getting him a gift. And all of a sudden, something, it feels as if something entered him. And he changed. He changed everything and threw the gift away. That's not like that. Was he under an influence or something? Did he drink? Of course he is. Yes, he is. I was sure he was under influence of something. When that fool Jerry called at that ungodly hour, I know he was up to something. But whatever it is, he is not going to escape me this time around. Babe, just take it easy, Sha. We need to think of a way forward now. Think of a way forward? My only way forward is how to deal with that stupid fool Jerry and put him to his place. He can't mess with me. Has he forgotten? Has he forgotten that I'm Wari and Eudo Pekin? It's not possible. No one will mess with me. I support you for that. Go ahead and do what you want to do. I still remember how loud I sounded that note of warning to you. I told you not to hawk. Yet you went and hawked, disrespecting me. I've said that you don't have any respect for me whatsoever again. Mama, how can you say that now? I just don't want to see you stressed for us. That's why I had to hawk. Well, you know, I was on my own selling my pure One girl, I brought her tem 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 temptation. Mm -hmm. You don't know that when you see temptation, you run. Mama, I ran. I even jumped and passed. But the girl dragged me inside temptation. I can't fall inside. That girl, a little demon. Mm -hmm. You should have just cast the demon away from her. By the way, what kind of a girl would beat you like this? Eh? Mama, I cast the demon out of her, she said. She collect water, water from my hand. My friend, keep Ask quiet. Ask Keep quiet. Did I not tell you not to beat a woman? Eh? I ran and leave her to beat him. Beat him as if I am not strong. She collect from my hand. They don't close for today. They don't close. Aha. Uh -huh. You're lucky I met you here. I cannot even get strength. Come your heart, come see. I swear. 
swear. What are you even talking about? So I should go and kill myself. First day of uh, I went to the market. Please, oh, I cannot come and kill myself. I talk her. See, I just like you, no fit in this village. Shut talk her. <laughs> what were you saying? You say I'm lucky. What happened? Any better for me? Um, I met uh, Chief so Chief Osundu's son, your boyfriend, Leonard. Yeah. Yes, he said he's been calling you. You are not picking his call. He went to the house. He didn't see anybody. He laid down bush on me. As the only one that can tell him your whereabouts. That's about what? Wait, I hope he didn't tell him anything. Are they mad? Why would I do that? Uh, but, come. The last time I checked, you told me that both of you were best of friends. And he's been of great help to you. So, what's going on? Look, my friend, that's why I started this business. Because I don't want to be at the mercy of anybody, mm -hmm. especially a man. Yes, I don't want to be at his mercy. <laughs> um, we are still best of friends, though, but some things have to be properly defined. <laughs> so, so, but from the look of things, I don't think he would go without seeing you today because he looks so persistent. Don't worry, I know what to do. I know what to do. What happened to you? Who did this to you? Not my sister, not my auntie caused all these things. What? Wait, you mean Am Amara did this Hi. to you? Oh, sorry. 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 No, no, they sorry. don't defend me. I don't know where I'm not, man. Man, don't defend me like this. Sorry. Hi, hi, sorry. Hi. But. You're really confusing me. I don't get a jack of what you're trying to say. You mean Amara actually beat you up? No. My teacher said the Kung Fu uh, stop while they used to train. See me, nobody touch him. Uh -huh. Say he will bring bad luck to me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. My mom come back, come meet my auntie, say she don't they chop my watermelon while they used to do training. Now I make this small demon boy defeat me today now. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Now I get your point. D don't worry, let me take you to the pharmacy, okay? No. Pharmacy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Get up, get up. Sorry, sorry, don't worry, be fine. Amara. Oh. Amara, are you okay? See, Amara, why don't you go home after a long day sales in the market? Eh? How are you even sure he's even at home? This is someone I've been dating for a long time now. So I know every inch of what he's capable of doing. Even if I'm wrong. It's better to take precaution this time. Amara, you're making me believe there is more than meets the eye. Are you guys having issues? No, far from it. I just want to give him space. 
<sighs> if I'm to advise you, please, Amara, don't elongate this piece. Because men have a very short lifespan when it comes to tolerance and patience. That, that is how I, I lost my, my beloved and found myself where I am today. But you have to go home, Amara. You have to. You just have to go home, okay? Onyema, you go better for you. Onyema, you see this fight where you begin. We go fight and reach the end. Nobody go wrong. If you don't enjoy me, I go enjoy you. Now like that, go to drum, go to drum. You go see me. They get parents. <coughs> now, could you treat me? They wait for you, sis. You don't know, come back. Never even say when you come out. You mean the other was here? Yeah. That's good, though. Very good. Good for you. Since you like to fight. Enjoy yourself. My daughter, you suck my blood. Now the only way you talk with that. Now what do you go tell? You know that now you cause this. Now what do you go talk with that? No wala. You see you on your man. You see you on your man. This one is Genesis. Before we go enter the doors, your body go tell you. No, we just calm down the weight. God go punish you. Hello, Leonard. Hi, Quinnette. I wasn't expecting to hear from you. Such is life now. You don't fashi us. The important thing make me they call you so. Really? I hope it's not that serious. It's very serious, so. My friend, she's dying. She's been crying since because of you. Quinnette, why would you have to say to my heart palpitating because of Evelyn? You know what I went through in the hands of that lunatic. No, this is different. This is different. She's really sad. You know, I wouldn't lie to you about something like this. Gwyneth, whatever that has changed, I don't care. You know what I went through in the hands of that lunatic. You know that I know. But please, consider this. Can I come to meet you so we can talk about this face to face? It's okay, Gwyneth, if you wish, but just know that. Nothing will come out of it. Okay? Thank you very much. Please. What is it about Evelyn? Yeah, I'm not going to do it. 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 I'm not going
What is it? I want to tell you something before we come out. You check out whatever you want to tell me, you have to be fast about it. As you can see, I'm going to the market. And to the team, say, number one, I want to start with telling you sorry for everything what I don't do. But fighting with our customers and this sorry. Mm. I get vision, revolution for last night. So I want to go for deliverance. Hmm. That's good. Yes, that's good. Because any more nonsense from you, Ichaka, I will just package you eh, and go and sell to kidnappers. Since you have decided not to be useful to yourself. That's the way you talk now. I see. But I will forgive you because God! Seneca has started forgiveness. Very good. See, and whatever you want to do, go ahead. But make sure before you leave this house, make sure you lock my door very well. Well, she's taking so much time. Oh. Hi, Queen Fine. I'm so sorry for keeping you away too. I had to sort out little issues with my boyfriend. Oh, that sounds nice. Really? How is it doing? It's fine. Okay. Um, you know I was running late already, but I had to keep up with the appointment. Thank you so much. By the way, you look gorgeous. Thank you. Thanks for being a gentleman. You too, you look good. Oh. Thanks for the compliment. You're welcome. So what can I offer you? Oh no, thanks. I don't think there is a need for that right now. Seeing that I've kept you waiting for a long time. Why don't we talk as you drive? That way I can tell you things about me and my friend. Wow. That's so reasonable of you. <sighs> I mean, I wish your girlfriend possesses the same quality. Oh please, Jenna, don't start. No two people are the same, not even identical twins. Can we go? All right, Your Majesty, right after you, please. They rush go under this hustle. Nobody did my shop, so I they go draw debts. I won't go collect my money before this woman travel. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> yes, so. Uh, what of Ichaka? That one. Eh. Yeah. That one woke up this morning you know, and said she's going for deliverance. <laughs> that she saw vision last night. Deliverance? <laughs> That's what she said. That girl is something else. Though. See, and that one is not even my headache. I need to hurry and collect my money from this woman. Though. 
before she traveled. Uh -huh. I heard she used to owe people. Be calm. Uh, please uh -huh. rush, eh? Uh -huh. All right, now take care. Thank you. Tell me, how did it go? Is it positive? You could temper now. I'm just coming in. Let me settle down. My blood, they hot. How did it go? Babe, I say cool your temper. See the things he got for us now. At least that shows you that there is positive results. See now. See all these things. Food and ice cream. Positive results. Babe, calm down. Good thing he was able to listen to us. So he didn't outrightly show that his back, but his body language says his back. His body language? Mm -hmm. How do you mean? Before he wasn't willing to listen to you, but now he's willing to listen to you. How else do you want me to describe it? This is a step forward. Oh. If he is willing to talk, that means you've done novel. Thank you so much. I just I hope you won't come and sleep off again. It all depends on you now, my dear friend. Whatever you do, you have to make sure you keep your man. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Whew, I'm hungry. Hello? I'm a Rabiko now, please. Please, how, how can you tell me all is well when all you've done is to avoid my calls and reject them? I understand you're still very much mad at me, but please, I'm sorry. How can I be mad at you and still pick your call to, to talk to you? Huh? I'm begging you, but Amara, it took you ages. Do you know the trauma you put me through? Do you? Well, that's little of what you've put me through. Each time you push me away from coming to your house without any cogent reason or excuse. Amara, please, let's just forget about the past. Let's forget about the past and fashion a new cause for ourselves, please. Well, the past cannot be left unattended. So tell me, which new cause do you want us to fashion when some issues are not resolved? Eh? Look, Leonard. As long as you're not ready to be completely open with me, then let's just be best of friends. Okay, okay, Amara, listen. Tell me when you want to come to my house, okay? I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready. Believe me. Anytime you want to come, you're welcome. Just tell me when. When do you want to come? Not anymore. At least, not anytime soon. I have other important things to attend to. At least, let me focus on my small business. I'll talk to you later. I have other things to attend to. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. What is happening? Did you shut up your mouth? Shut up your mouth. What do you know? Do you know what he did? No, I don't know anything. But my Bible and my apostle make me understand. Say, if you want the peace of mind, one day happy, you will forgive anybody who offends you. Like that, like that. You will be happy for your life. This girl, what is wrong with you? Eh? Did I tell you I have issues with anybody? 
You had better concentrate on this food and go and sleep. Oh. Andy, go calm and down. Sleep. Calm down. I know you. I know you to your inner, inner, inner bone marrow. I know where you live. I don't say you like that, Uncle Leo. You like them, but this, they do like this. They do like this. They do like this. <laughs> I don't understand them. I know what you're looking for this night. Hmm? You're looking for someone to gossip with you. Yes, you're looking for gossip this gossip. night. Mm. But you see that gossip. I can't do it. Hmm? I can't do that with you right now. But remember, Steve, love is sweet. But the only love where they real, where they're authentic, and the love of God. If you love a woman being, you love God extra. If you love a woman being small, you love God too. Hey, Shaka, it's like you're done with it. You're done eating. Eh? Yeah? Never done. Then shut up your mouth and eat. It was all my fault. I shouldn't have been treated her that way. But I didn't just want her to come in between my crossfire with Evelyn. But it's over now. I will find a way to tell her everything. Everything. No. Luna, don't do this. You might lose her if you do. But I don't even understand Evelyn these days. Is she truly repentant? Well, that's her business. She pushed me off and I have found true love. But Amara appears to be unforgiving. Mm. What do I do? What do I do? Oh God, help me. My friend, sorry I barged in your, on you like this. It's because of the urgency of this matter. Urgency of this matter? I hope it's not uh, this market task force because my sister is not owing them. Don't you they calm down? Uh, have I said anything like that? Look, I want you to tell me what made you lose your man. <laughs> Imagine this ceremony, adult place. Is that the urgency that brought you here this morning? No four hands, though. I'm already done four hands. There's nothing like falling off hands here. Look, I'm, I'm just worried. I have a feeling that Leonard might change his mind towards me. I'm already it's obvious we love this guy. Then why don't you stop playing this hard girl before he falls into the hands of these city girls? Come, no four mugu like me. That's the reason I came. Hmm? So that you would. I will know the mistake you made and I won't make the same. <laughs> My situation might not be as serious. I was just deceived by a friend. I was just expecting my guy that he's cheating on me. And my friend kept telling me, men are this, men are that. That I shouldn't let any man fool me. It's a very sad story. I don't want to remember it. Tell me. Tell me what happened. I said I don't want to remember it. But all I can tell you is that AGK is married to Chica, my so called friend that deceived me. What? Yes, they are married. <sighs> Daughter of Zion, you are a blessing to this generation. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. A very great blessing to this generation. You see, as I was speaking in tongue, the Lord appeared to me in tongue. And I heard him and he spoke to me in tongue. And I heard him in tongue. Which is to say, you are anointed in tongue for exploit. 
And that is why some forces from the kingdom of hell are manipulating, trying to destroy and go for good. We are going to pray to cast away every powers from the pit of hell, principalities, demons that possess you, the spirit of anger, which makes you to fight every time and anywhere, and in turn denying you the blessings and miracle that God has for you. We are going to pray. That devil is a liar. Let us prepare task today. What happened to us, my love? Yes, I know we've been in talking times, but everything has changed. How do you mean everything has changed? You know I have something that keeps me busy. So you don't expect me to give you all my time like before? I'm not talking about the time. I'm talking about the connection, the affection. Everything has obviously dropped. I want us back. Look, one thing you need to understand is, is that when an injury heals, the spots can never be the same. The scar on the spot will remain there for a long time, especially when it's a deep cut. Oh, Tamara, I didn't know what happened could be such a deep cut. Liana, can we not go over this again? Please, I need to get back to the market. There's no one there and Ichaka went for her normal preaching. It's okay, let me drop you. No, no, no. Don't be me for that. I insist. Please. Elegant and beautiful. Yes. Babe, which one is dressed to kill again? This is my old dress now. Don't you know this one? I know. Of course I know it. 
relationship is written all over you and i'm happy for you see the way your relationship is on high cruise why my own don't fall your pattern oh babe don't don't talk like that please at least you're talking terms with him you guys talk on phone mm. talking terms baby phone relationship that one a relationship eh this is more reason why i wanted to deal with that stupid fool jerry but he wouldn't let me he was the one that caused this whole thing for me but jerry is not the cause of your problem you know what let's pay leonard the surprise visit surprise visit yes of course you know who leonard is please i am not in for his disgrace and rejection don't be worried about that we'll go and visit kelvin then from there we we'll reach leonard's side don't worry everything will be fine what do you think uh, don't worry. It'll be fine. On the map, Echi, on the map, Echi. My name is on the map, Echi. Nobody knows tomorrow. I cut off my face, my ears, my nose, my nose and the. Mama, that's it. One way that bless me today. I have told you to stop speaking that rubbish to me because I don't understand it. Mama, it's not rubbish. You don't call it rubbish. It's called Patwa. Original heavenly language from Jamaican Gero. You don't know? I don't care. I don't even I don't even know who. Who deceived you into building this image you're building now? Eh? Mm, stop calling it names. Stop calling it names. Because this is the kind of thing that will make me make the kind of money I want to use and go to the city and, and, and get bigger. <sighs> Unyema. And invest. Unyema. Just keep saving your money. Hmm? Keep saving it. One day. You will save up to the required amount and you will go to the city. Or who knows? You might even find your destiny helper. That person will take you to the city. That time I will have peace of mind. Eh. Mm. Ha! Mama take out live only in this village. Is a lie. Yeah, mama, by the way, is there any food for job boy? I have food for my son, Onyema. But I don't have for job boy. It's not job boy, it's job boy. Jagged. Original African mama, yeah, mama. Jaffy bless Anna and her children, mama. You know. Everybody like I cut up my face, my nose, my ears. It's too bad morning for my mom. For the moon. Thank you. I'm filled. <laughs> You're such a good cook. I'm glad you love it. Always, always. Mm -hmm. What? What's with the big smile? You know, I'm happy. I'm happy that we are back together. Amara. I promise never to hurt you again. Leonard, it's okay. It's all right. You've been saying this since we're inside. It's okay, all right? Look, you need to start going. You're going far. I've been begging you to go since, but you wouldn't even let go of me. My existence has yielded divided. If I had gone that time, maybe your heart wouldn't have melted like it did. Is it because you know I love you so much? That's why you were so comfortable making me an option. In case your other girlfriends feel right? No, Amara, stop. No, let's not go back and forth with all this, okay? Look, 
right now you are the only woman in my life and that's what matters to me and the hazard has been an issue you now have the spare key so you have nothing to worry about <laughs> so what you can also give another girl the spare key so it doesn't make me special anyways that's aside you need to go i'm just i'm worried i don't want you to make traffic you know you can't predict traffic not before you give me a warm hug for the delicious meal yeah. come here okay Go now. I miss you so much. I missed you too. Hey! Ichaka! Ichaka, what's your problem? Eh? Una dee the sin against God. For God's face! Ha! See eh? Before I open my eyes and you are still here, what I will do to you, you won't like it. No, 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 oh, yeah! No, no. Remember, the Lord is watching you. Remember. Are you still here? No, 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 no. You, don't, you don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. She's just a kid. You don't know this girl. This girl is very stubborn. Very stubborn. Okay. It's fine. Look, you have to go. We have to go now so that, um, you know, you still have a long way to go. Been waiting. Sorry, my bad. Why are you staring at us like that? Are you scared or something? No, not really. Just that I am dazzled by your elegant apparels. <laughs> <laughs> and that is more reason you should not keep ladies waiting on the door. As a gentleman. <laughs> Come on in, beautiful ladies. Thank you. Thank you. Make yourselves comfortable. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm, someone is obviously in a good mood. Yeah, I kind of won a trophy. Whoa! <laughs> really? This calls for a celebration. Yes, and it shows that our visit today is divinely ordained. Exactly. <laughs> Guy, go bring drink for us now. Mm -hmm. Okay, you girls should make yourselves comfortable. Your I'll be back. Ooh, it's okay. gonna be a little celebration. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up! Okay. Ichaka. It's a good thing that you're awake. What was the meaning of that nonsense you just did? You did this evening. Yes. I'm not doing nonsense today. This is what I do today at the walk of God. Only. You want me to squeeze this your ear for you? Eh? What did you do this evening when I was kissing my fiance? What was the meaning of that? Now that one. That one. Hm. I'm not doing nonsense. So what can I do? Now what can God say me can do? Now the one who wanna do be same and God no like that. And now what you make me say, make one repent. Say the kingdom of God they attend though. Ishaka. What special woman being are you? Eh? When I was having issues with Leonard, you were the one that was telling me what the Holy Spirit did not tell you. You were preaching about love and forgiveness. Now that you are back together, you say we are sinning. I don't I understand. This love and forgiveness are why they talk. For the same way, go the peace. Why do you say make you forgive and make me make you go be sad? Now, we think Judas did Jesus be this way. After you kiss and finish, they crucify Jesus. You, where you want land? Me will be careful. Me will be careful. Avoid sin. 
It's see you and that's your confused pastor. Both of you, you need help. In fact, you need Jesus. Now, is there everybody waiting for this life? Need help. Now, what do you make them sing? My help, oh, my help. I even need for Bible. My help, I need for this Bible. Is there here? A prayer for help. Be merciful to me. Be merciful to me. See him. Everybody need help. This one, both of you are just staring at each other. I feel I should just leave you guys to your privacy. What's privacy after this much celebration? <laughs> celebration? What are we even celebrating? Not like you've shown all the trophy you won, even. <laughs> <laughs> and baby, do I take it that we are back together? <laughs> as friends, yes. But as lovers, nah. I don't think that would be possible. I mean, after all I went through in your hands, you humiliated me. So there is no going back. Bros, Evelyn is a really changed person. She has transformed. She hasn't stopped talking about you for months now. <sighs> Quinnette, I don't even understand you. Why is support of this? I mean, there were days I wanted all this good girl vibe. But all I got was humiliation. Nah, it's too late. There is no going back. Leonard, please forgive me. I know I messed up big time. I take all the blame. Let me join you in this your train of onward going so we can move in together. Nah, that won't be possible. Maybe I should tell you girls the trophy I won today. Well, the good news is I won back the heart of a woman I love so much. And I'm sure you wouldn't like to know why we fall out. No need for you to tell us, Leonard. We don't want to hear it. But just know that a new fresh wine today will still become an old sour wine tomorrow. You think so? Of course. Just give her a chance. So, what's up with you, Quinette? What has been happening? I need to leave town and cool off. I mean, which face I won't take see that guy for road? Ah, Evelyn, I know you are a fighter. You always conquer. You know, most times I'm against your actions, what you do. I'm always advising you against them. After what happened last night, you've earned my respect, girl. Please, don't go anywhere. Stay and fight to finish. On to what? No, which level now? I'll just stay and start fighting. It's not possible. I don't pass that level. See, I need to move. The shame is too much. Hey. Please. Let me shame? Town. Which shame? It's just the three of us. You, me and him. Even from his actions last night, I can tell that he has been emotionally tortured. That guy will come back to you someday. Girl, don't go. I beg, I beg, I beg. I don't want reason your matter. I see you. Your own matter. I don't want reason them. Because now your own way here, they disturb my ear like this. Make I, yeah. I don't want. Make I push. Easily. Where are you going to? Come back and fight, oh! Don't go anywhere. Evelyn, come back, oh! 
Come and finish what you have started. Daughter of Zion, like I always told you, the heavenly race is not an easy one. That is why Jesus said, He that endureth till the end shall be saved. And a man's enemy is member are members of his own household. So if he starts from your household, blessed are you, because you shall receive your hand on the I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything. I don't see it. See the truth. Tell them. She can't defense anyhow. <laughs> like I told you before. The master himself said, He that must follow me must deny mother, father, brother, sister, uncle, auntie, Friends and good things of the world and carry his cross and follow me. So let all men be liars and God be the truth. If you do what the scripture says and they persecute you, blessed are you, for there I wait for you a crown of glory in heaven. This crown is that is the spirit, daughter of Zion. That is the spirit. I'm happy you're bright. Now go in this your might. Declare the word of God. Keep declaring. Keep marching. Because you are a conqueror. You are a winner. You are a winner. Say you are a winner. I'm a winner. You say you are a winner. I'm a winner. That is the spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, daughter of Zion. The Lord is doing a lot for you. Amen. Let me bless you once more. Malabados Kitibash. That your prediction worked like magic. You see? Honestly, your plan, eh? Your plan worked. Hey, you see? Genius, so... What is it? Hey. I told you. Eh? I told you I won't let anyone I know to fall in the same pit I fell in. Hmm. I'm telling you. Hmm. Yes, that is wickedness and, and foolishness to, uh, to get combined together now. Don't hmm. you know? Hmm. I won't. But you needed to see the way he was apologizing to me. As if he's the one that offended me. When in real sense, I'm the one that wronged him. <laughs> you know, eh? In relationship, girls don't offend guys. Mm. Guys do. Yes. And as long as the girl has the key to their hearts, even when they are wrong, they will, always, they will always say, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. My dear, I just pray it lasts long. I just pray it lasts, so... Hey! You, you needed to see the way he was kissing me. The passion he used in kissing hmm. me. Before that, uh, Ichaka. Ichaka came in with her madness. I beg, leave Ichaka alone. Yes, she's working on her own calling. <laughs> That's her own calling, she's working Onyema, my good friend. I don't have what to do. Leave me alone. Your father is a rich man and you are a classic girl. Even a graduate, me, I just managed to finish secondary school. And I and my family, we are poor, we don't have one. Come on, Vito Who said I want anything from you? And 
come to think of it, why did you say you're classless? I mean, yeah. you're a good entertainer. If it is in the city, you'll be making much money. Yeah. Honestly. You see, I want that monkey man. I want to take from here now, ghost. I be one make I miss. I want to take from here, ghost. Now I do have tell you, me I'm not good with food. I don't need that kind of thing. Really, man. If you want me to help you, I will. I love your music. I like the way you sing. I'm not available. I, oh, I wish I get money. I could just buy a guitar. Then my village do wrong things. Really? Yes. Really. Like I said before, I don't want anything from you. And if it is this guitar, I will arrange it for you. If it's going to the city, I will also arrange that for you. Hmm? Yes, honestly. Because I like your music. I like the way you sing. Yes. You don't believe me? <sighs> like seriously? Nobody knows tomorrow. I cut off my face, my ears, my nose. I know Zendo. I cut off my face, my nose. My ears. Beautiful temptation, British. From my mouth. 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 From my face, my nose. He's such an embodiment of virtue. An amazing soul. <sighs> he may not be financially rich, but he's not freaked by wealth. That's a real man. Yes. He has a wealthy character. I mean, every man in this village will do anything to get me smile at them. He's so smart to have coded all the advances I made at him, despite how innocent I made it look. Oh! Lord! I'm falling in love with this guy. I mean, won't I appear crazy to be dying for him? Ah, no, 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 Lord. Oh Lord, I think I'm falling in love with this guy. Won't it appear crazy that I'm dying for him? <sighs> I mean, he may not be physically big, but he's mentally and spiritually a giant after all i'm not crazy no i'm not mm. Mm -mm. i'm not i mean i like him yeah my name is Edgy, nobody knows tomorrow. I cut off my face, my ears, my nose. I know Zendo. I cut off my face, my nose, my ears. It's too bad the morning from my mouth. From the morning. From my mouth. From the morning. From the morning. Oh, yeah, ma. Ah, ah. No. What will a small boy like you be thinking about? A small boy like you shouldn't be thinking too much, oh. Oh, give me. I need to leave this village. I need to leave this village. My talent is resting in this village. And I'm getting um, small, small money, so. But that, that will not be enough for me to go to the city. I want to go to the city. Eh, take it easy now. Where are you? Now that you're saving, keep saving. 
Yes, yeah, small, 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 like that. You will gather enough to take you to the city. And you don't know how things happen, no? You, your Messiah can come, your destiny helper can come and help you, and you will go. One is already coming, but yeah. I, don't trust, I don't trust the person at all. Uh -uh. I don't have anything to return. Return, Opa? No. When somebody helps you and you pay something in return, that is no longer help. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, but she, uh, I, don't, I don't trust her. She? Yes. She, what? In this village? Yes, it's peace. Um, 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 Chief Michael's daughter. Onya Kiji, why you? Eh? Chief Michael's daughter promised to do something for you and you're doubting it. I don't trust her. You have to trust her. Because goodness runs in their blood. It's not just her. Oh. You see, her father, her late mother, her brothers, her sisters, every one of them, they are the nicest set of people in this our village. Hey, <laughs> I don't know. Hey! I was even about saying no. Don't, don't try it. Don't say no at all. If they say they will do something for you, they will do it. Oh, don't doubt her. Okay. Hey, hey you should be jubilating by now. Enokwa. Hey. Yeah, she, she's one of the people that used to like my music. So. She now said that, and I, if I want, she can buy me guitar. And if I also want, she can take me to the city. I say no, I don't trust her. The mama, which one is saying no? Eh? I even wanted to ask you how you met her. You, you should be happy. Consider it done. If she told you that she would do it, she would definitely do it. Yeah. Uh -huh. So you are talking like the, like they are nice. You see, very nice. The nicest set of people in this our village. It's so okay. cool. Okay, that means I will hold that. I'll hold that tight. You see, that dancing. What? I don't want you to be thinking like that again. You're a small boy. You shouldn't. Oh? Okay. Ha! Ah. Yay! This is not exactly how you see it. You needed to have been here to see for yourself. Anyways, I'm sorry, Daddy. Just try and investigate the matter. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Thank you, Daddy. Yes. Please, eh, send my driver to go buy me the guitar. Send it through Korea. I'll go get it from the park. Yes. Thank you, Daddy. I love you. <laughs> yeah. And one more thing, Daddy. I need more money in my account. Yes! Oh, thank you, Daddy. You're the best daddy in the world. Yes. Huh? Yes. I'm so happy. Everything is working out as I expect. Yes. 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 Kelvin, I did not call you here for all this. First, it was to come buy me food, and the next, you're already discouraging me from traveling. See, Kelvin, I need your financial assistance. I need to leave town, and I don't want to ask Queenness for the money. Um, of course, you know. You know I will not let you leave this town with this story you are telling me there. You need to go to somewhere and chill your head. Then think about it. Starting life afresh in a new environment is not that easy. Starting life afresh? Yes. I am not trying to start life afresh. Do I have that kind of money? I am not. I only want to leave town to chill. Evelyn, you may not say it, but your action says it all. You can uh, uh, have a break from your journey here in this city, and nobody will know that you are here, except the ones you want them to know. You're talking as if I have 
such money to fund such luxury? I don't. Do not talk as if I do not want to assist you with the money you ask me of. I can double that money or even triple it right here. You know I won't let you go in this mood. Kelvin, please, do this for me. If you want me to kneel down, I will kneel down. Please, help me now. Uh, listen, you really wanted to do this or you are running away from your fears. Uh, anyways, um, let me have your account number. What bank is it? Okay. Let me put your account number. Oh. My dear. Hey, hey. I can't believe you made that abacha. I honestly, I wouldn't have believed you were the one that made that abacha. If not that, I was there when you were preparing it. Yes, now. My sister, that's one native food that till today I still cannot prepare. Even not far. Mm. Yes, now. You see? You see why it's an honor to be an Enugu girl? Yes, now. <laughs> the two food you mentioned are the best Enugu delicacies. Mm. See, I will advise you. You marry an Enugu guy that knows how to cook very well. Ah! <laughs> don't make a year old. Marry with Enugu guy. See, I am cool with my man the way he is. Enugu or not. Mm -hmm. Yes. Hey, talking about your man, you told me that his number wasn't connected. Has his number connected? Hey, yes, so oh. I just spoke to him a while ago. Yeah. Hey, let me call him again. <laughs> Keep this phone, Jare. Uh -uh, don't overdo everything now. How? You just spoke with him. Want to call him again? I beg, don't overdo everything. Njide, I don't understand you. Why you not the one that told me to hold my man? I should not let go of him. And now you're the one saying I'm overdoing things. How? I don't understand. Which one do you want me to follow? Eh, uh, don't call him. I think the best thing you should do is to pay him a visit in the city. Uh -huh. Since you have the key to the house, just pay him a visit. You're right, though. Uh -huh. I will visit him. Uh -huh. Hey! S see, see, let me tell you. See what you will do, eh? Mm. You will not tell him it's the exact time you are coming. You tell him you are, co you are coming so so time. Mm -hmm. Just go there and see things for yourself since you have the key to the house. Yes. Quinette, you got me so worried. Really? Don't tell me you have issues with Evelyn. Would you at least offer me a seat? You're a gentleman. You have like one. Forgive my manners. Please sit. Thank you. So what happened? Not even a glass of water, my coolest gentleman. Oh, forgive my manners once more. Please, what can I offer you, please? Don't worry, sit down. It's fine. I won't take anything. I was the one that needed you, so I'm fine. Quinet, why do you always like sweeping me off my feet? I mean, no one's manipulating me like you do. I wish your girlfriend was as smart as you. Talking about Evelyn, she's even the reason why I'm here. Quinet, don't tell me you're serious. I'm very serious. Evelyn has changed for good. You know, we've been friends for ages. We've had our differences, but if you see the way she is now, it's unbelievable. I'm telling you. Well, that's good for her, but what has that got to do with me? Honestly, because I don't understand. I don't. I practically told you last night that I just made up with a girl who loves me for who I am. Who, of course, broke up with me because of your girlfriend, Evelyn. So what exactly do you want me to do? You know, they perfectly understand. No, no, you don't understand, Quinette. You don't. Listen, her change has everything to do with you. Your, your girl, it's just a fresh relationship. Even had to even leave town this morning, very depressed. This is no game. Well, that sounds like a good news. But I won't break another girl's heart for someone who 
who was treated me like a piece of rock in the past. You know, sometimes I really wish you were the one I was dating. Yes, because I know I won't find myself in this dilemma. Believe me. Are you serious about this last statement you just made? Yeah. Though we are both taken. Complicated. This whole idea of we coming to your house is a wrong move. What if Pina should walk in here and see the two of us together? That would be serious betrayal to her. In what way? In what way, Evelyn? We are not doing anything bad here. Besides, helping her friend in distress is not something she should oppose to. Did you say helping her friend? Yes. Helping her friend that was supposed to be out of town by her calculation and knowledge. Her friend had left the house this morning with luggage only to be found in her boyfriend's apartment without her knowledge. Oh, come on, Kelvin. Come on. Uh, 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 listen, listen, listen. I am just trying to help. And if you can remember, the idea of not telling her was entirely yours. Yes. I just said I don't want her to know that I'm in town. I'm scared. Finet, I know, might badging on us. You know what? Do not worry yourself about that. Relax. I can assure you here that Queen Ed is not coming here. Yes, she's not coming. Yes. Besides, you, you can miss your flight. Uh, yes. <laughs> miss my flight? Of course. Huh. You know this is childish and flimsy excuse. Please, I need you to call Queen Ed right now and let her know I'm in your house. Please. Uh, no, no, no. I, I, you are not being serious here. I, I cannot do that. Um, I, I, I'm assuring you that Queen Ed is not coming here. I know her very well. But don't worry yourself. Tell your luggage inside so I can freshen up for you. You understand? Okay? What is wrong with Kelvin's line? Why is he not connecting? He's not picking up. Ah, he's even busy in my call. You can imagine. What is it? Why is your face like that? Finn, what are you doing here? What is it? Why are you looking at me as if you've seen a ghost? <sighs> the evening I know would have called <clears throat> if she missed her flight. Or even, not even badging out on me like this. Babe, what happened? Babe, free me, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. I know they're in the mood now. I have a very rough day. Please. Babe, you never talk true. You're not supposed to be in town by this time. What happened to you? Tell me. Please, it's a very long story and I'm not in the mood to talk right now. Please. And who are you talking with? And why is your face like that? Do not care of it. Throughout today, he either busies my call or he hasn't even picked it at all. I don't know what's wrong with him. Mm -hmm. Kevin is a guy now. Maybe he's on his way to club. Who knows? Today is Friday. Club? Yeah. How, how do you know that he'll be at the club? When did Kelvin start clubbing? <laughs> You're the girlfriend, you should know now. If you ask me, you know who I go ask? Oh, you should know. Yes. Babe, that's, that's surprising. Babe, hope say you cook something. Though. You were supposed to help me come on my shoe or something. Let me go freshen up. Hmm? Please, bring my bag inside.
Um, Ichika, I want to discuss with you right now before I go to bed. Come. Oh. Only no few minutes. You know, few minutes. You used to say that they perform my, my spiritual duties. You know, few minutes. You cannot wait. You cannot wait. Uh -uh. Besides, what I want to tell you won't take time. You know, say it now when I sit there for the world. I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to even give you this new thing. But as a spirit needs. Go on. Tell me what you want to talk. And if you talk, I'm dead fast. Because Holy Spirit. Make the light make the cut and short. Holy Spirit, make the light make the grief and so anything where they talk, make them fast and brief. Yes, ma. I'll be traveling to the city for a few days. So I was hoping if you could create chance so that you can help me stay at the shop. Now that you say you are no longer in the world, I'm sure you won't have issues with any customer. Hey! Hey! Waiting I'll do you. And to waiting I'll do you now. Waiting I'll do you. Why they do me this thing? Why you they do that all of Zion this thing now? Nah? Igood. Ichaka. Idikwa okay. Are you alright? You speak and be Idikwa okay. I dare you. You see I dare you spirit. You can't carry your own form. You can't hold your spirit short because say you won't make an enter world again. Make an enter inside world go to commit sin. Because say you won't go see to go commit sin. You won't make an also commit sin with you. And who told you I'm going to the city to commit sin? Ah. Eh? You know what? Don't stay you again. You don't go anywhere. Come here. Don't no, stay ask for again. Men will ask for forgiveness. So we don't see, you know. For you to even have this kind of thing in your mind. You don't see, you know. So men will ask God for forgiveness now. This is like you, you, you want me to beat you this night, Shibu. You want me to beat you this night. Better respect yourself. Something is definitely wrong with this your head. No wow. God is here. Don't say it. I hey. tell him on time. Oh. I tell him I will ask for forgiveness. So. Now only me want ask for forgiveness. Forgive only me. She no want ask for forgiveness. Now only me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My name is Onyema. Echi. Nobody knows tomorrow. I cut off my face. My ears, my nose, I know sender. I cut on my face, my nose, my ears. It's too bad in the morning for my mouth. Oh, you. I'm afraid. I'm afraid to get down. It shows you are talking at me. It's too much. <laughs> at least you can see that I am the new, and I don't want anything from you. Yes, so my, my mom told me about your family. They all told me that you are very nice people. Yes, that's why as soon as I go to me, she just started running till I got here, and I had to wait now since I don't have anything to go. But no problem. Thank you, chef. Oh, wow. I thank you very much. You told your mom about me? Yes, so I tell her everything. She's all I have. She's all I have. So I have to, have to leak all my secrets for her. Mm -hmm. But after the thank you so much. You don't know what this means to me. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, I love it. Not to worry. Um, about the phone, I'll try and see what I can do about that song. Uh -uh. No, now you have already gotten me guitar and you still want to get me phone. It's too much. This is why I'm afraid that I might be looking for something in return for me. Yes, because you're always interested in getting me happy all the time. Well, mm, you already said your mom. She said my family were nice. So, fear no more. It's just a natural likeness. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. How about your mom? How is she? She's fine. Oh, she's in her business center. Oh. I'm not in my guitar center. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. Um, one of these days, I'll try and patronize her. Oh, thank you, thank you. Um, I would have asked you to come inside, but I don't know how you're going to. I won't see it anyhow. In fact, I can leave you two inside this house. But I have to go and show my mom this guitar. See the hot. Mm -hmm. Yes, I will return. I think. I promise you. I, I see the hot. Yes, see the hot. It's all right. It's all good. Um, that's good. You can go and show her, right? <laughs> Alright, we'll get
Bless you, Lord, for this soul, for this wonderful gift to the body of Christ. We exalt you for what you've done. Thank you for our sister, Bichaka. This is a soul she has converted. Your name will be blessed in Jesus' name. Amen. This soul is committed into your hand. She will not backslide. She will run the race to the end. Amen. You will keep blessing her and keep lifting her and keep showing her the way. Amen. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. And amen. Sister, stand. You are blessed. Just be sure that you continue with everything we've told you and the Lord will continue to bless you. Look at our sister here, Chaka. She's your mother in faith. She will be checking up on you from time to time to make sure you continue in the race and the Lord will keep blessing you. God bless you. God bless. Okay. Bye. Wow. 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 Sister Chaka. You see? Sister Blessing here is your soul. A product of your evangelism. You see why I say you should not relent? Wow. To God be the glory. Um, he remains mortal. Makes you no follow me come because of my sister. God forbid evil. Uh, why? <laughs> to say make I leave this for why did you go and shop, go stay for her. Imagine the temptation. <laughs> Sister Ichaka, that is not temptation. Even as a child of God, you have to help out in the business of the house. Because even the Bible says, he that does not work should not eat. Sure. Second Thessalonians 3 10. Refer. Shop. Blood of Jesus. No, that is not that. Oh, is that the case? Yes. No, if that is the case, we are going to pray that God will give you grace to overcome all forms of temptation. Amen. The grace must be given unto you. Amen. Let us pray. Look at my face, my nose, my ears, and you got the morning from my mouth. It took so much time. What delayed you? Was she the one that delayed you? She delayed me small because when I when I got there she was not around. But I want to go and play for my friends because I know you'll be busy with your business. Don't you think you should have shown me first before going to play for your friends? Onyema, you didn't do well at all. I hope you thanked her. Yes, so I thanked her very well. <laughs> I, I'm sorry for not showing you first. She even promised to buy me a phone. Really? Yes, sir. A phone? Mm -hmm. Hey, God will bless her. Amen. Ah, God will really, really bless her. Welcome. I'm done for the day. Yeah. Okay. Won't you play for me? No, no. You save my mind from the You give my mind. I really wish to travel this week. Hmm. But you know my landlady now. She said she cannot leave the work of her father and go and stay at the shop. And you know my girl cannot handle everything on her own. Michaka is a real kiss. Well, actually, this her new calling has really changed her fighting uh, skills.
kill us, Chandi. Mm -hmm. Us fighting, whatever. See, nobody is, nobody is denying that. But Ichaka is becoming more mischievous as the day goes by. Do you know that the other day she was crying? She was saying that she joined her for prayers, asking God for forgiveness because I want to go to the city to commit sin. <laughs> Wait. This, this is not a laughing matter. Please. I beg. I'm not smiling, no. I'm not. Wait. <laughs> this is not really fun. You actually want her to commit sin with you. Uh -huh. Mommy, you almost hear this, though. <laughs> I don't know anything they make you laugh for. After all, were you not the one that advised me to go to the city? <laughs> eh? Yes. Yes, I said you should go to the city, but not to go there and commit sin. Eh? So what's the whole issue? You want to involve the daughter of GO2 in your case of iniquity. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. As a matter of fact, I don't even blame I don't blame both of you. I don't. When I'm ready to go and see Leonard, I will just lock up my shop and go to the city. I don't have time for you both. See, Amara, you don't have to lock the shop. I will stay in your shop. I will stay for you till you come back. MJD, are you serious? Yes. What are friends for? Or oh, you're joking with me? I'm not joking. Yes, I will stay there. My friend. Yes. I say you should go to the city, but not to go there and commit sin. Eh? <laughs> you, 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 you want me to use the pass on you, back? Yes. <laughs> okay, so see now. So what's the need you went to involve a uh, daughter uh, G.O. in your case of iniquity? Check it now. <laughs> Him to call you. I told him to get the information of when you will be at home so that I can come and thank you for everything you have done for him and the ones that you promised to do. Hey, God. Mama, good afternoon. Uh, good afternoon, my daughter. <laughs> he actually told me, but I prefer to come and see you. It, it, it won't look nice for you to come and see me at home. That would be disrespectful of me now. My daughter, thank you. Thank you. You're just like your mother. Beautiful inside and outside. May God rest your mother's soul for bringing you up the way she did. God bless you. Uh, let me get you sick. Ah, no, Mama. Don't worry. I'll, I'll go and get you. Don't worry. You're such a wonderful person. Thank you, Mama. God bless you. Amen. Ah, God bless your mother for raising you like this. Amen. And bless your father. Amen. Whatever he lays his hands upon must surely prosper. Amen. Thank you. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hey. Um, Mama, mm -hmm. that's not you know. I actually stayed this long because I had to go get this phones for him mm. okay yes phone. phones um it's two inside the big one is for Wenyema. why the small one and other things are for you you bought me a phone mm -hmm. me phone owner yes mama hey thank you may god bless you Amen. Eh? i have not even finished thanking you for the guitar you bought for him and you're buying us phones that's nothing. God will forever bless you Amen. for me. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Meanwhile, um, that's your small business. Mm -hmm. You will go and look for a bigger shop. I told my dad about it and he promised to get you a very nice big shop. So get it. Hey, check it. God, is this how good you are? Chineke, he married him, Mao. He married him, Mao. He married him, Mao. Chineke, he married him, Mao. No, Mama. Thank you. Oh, 
Queenette, yes. I want you to explain to me the exact meaning of what you said. What is going on between me and your friend? Oh my goodness, B. Don't tell me this is why you called me out here. Exactly why I called you here. Because I cannot discuss such serious issues over the phone. So I want you to give me a direct answer. This is not happening. I must be dreaming. Please. I don't have time for this. I'm going into the house. I'm not in for this public show. My friend, come back here. Hey, listen to me. Stand here and explain to me the meaning of that rubbish. <sighs> Kelvin, you're embarrassing me in public. Same way you embarrass me. By thinking inside this your little brain that I will have anything to do with your friend, Evelyn. Evelyn was in a distress. And I decided to be of help with my own good heart. You now turn it against me. Kelvin, if you are in my shoes, what would you have done? I called you all afternoon, evening and night, and you never picked my calls. What were you expecting from me? A tap at the back? So, I should have informed you with, before helping your friend. Wait, wait. Is that how many people you are in life? Can you imagine how insensitive and the jealousy had made you? You cannot help a friend that squatted you for years now that she has a little problem. Shame on you, Queen. Shame on you! Excuse me? Squatted who? You, of course. <laughs> That's what she told you. This come up this hypocritical maneuver. You kept my girlfriend in your house for hours. That's a clear indication that you had an ulterior motive. Kelvin, if you really want to know what genuine help is, you should find out from her boyfriend she had issues with to know what really happened. Please, I leave you to your conscience. You can, you, can, you, can, you can go to hell with your useless, sanctimonious lifestyle. I don't care. Rubbish. To wipe my head, jaw. Eh? Anyway, thanks accepted. Um, just get ready to go to the city because great tax things are yet to come. Eh? Yes. Wake me up, wake me up, my baby. I'm sure I'm sleeping. Just wake up. It's too much now. Get up, wake up, wake up. Hey, thank you so much. Thank uh -huh. you so much. Don't enough for me now. Why am I now still going to? They're just embracing me with good things. Left and right. They want to keep me with good things. Calm down. Uh-uh. Do you want to quit the scene here? No. Eh? Meanwhile, I would have asked you to come inside though. But, you know, you can force a horse to the river, but you cannot force it to drink water. No. It's not like that. You have brought both my spirit, my body and my soul. So I can live with you in this house for as long as you want. Mm -hmm. But now, eh, I need to go and know what I'll do for my mom. Yeah. You understand? Yeah, but I'll come back tomorrow, I promise. I might even sleep. Hmm. Yes. Are you sure? Yes, now. Nah. The promise, so. Yes, now. Nah. Promise. Oh, it's promise. Promise is promise. I know. Hmm. Yeah. It's alright, no problem. Bye, bye, bye. <laughs> alright, take care of yourself, yeah? Uh, thank you. Take care, yeah? Uh, Yes. What is the meaning of this? Do you have to confront your boyfriend over hosting me yesterday after stopping me from leaving town? Wait, he actually called you? Yes, he did. And that is why I am going Ghana. What exactly is really going on between the both of you? What's going on? You are the thing that is going on. How dare you? No, how dare you? How dare you accuse us of having something to do together? Is, Quinnett, is this how cheap you see me? No, is this how loose you see me? After all these years, Kelly, I have no issues with you. 
That's why I confronted Kelvin. The way he's acting, his actions shows he has an ulterior motive. You are mad. No, Willet, you are mad for trying to accuse the both of us together. You are mad. Yes. You know, I, I thought you were wise, but now I realize that you are a fool, a big one. Me, a fool. What will you do about it? Please, 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 don't bring Ichaka Mata up again, please. Because she's the only headache I have in this house. So don't add to it, else I'll hang up this call. Please don't drop the call. You know I've missed you so much. So tell me, how is your day and how is the market today? Huh? It was fine, no, just stress. But Njide, she's been very supportive. She's been supportive in every way. I owe her a lot. Wow. That's good to know. So baby, tell me, now that you have all the rights, when are we expecting you? I won't tell. But I'll come soon. You know, the daughter of Eve came in like a thief. It could be in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening. So just get prepared and wait for her. Babe, I hope it won't be like the one of Son of Man, no. Because him own don't he. Well, make him never come. Because me never ready. <laughs> Before I call, I never chop life finish now. So make him never come. <laughs> eh, so now why you no one marry, ba? Did dear now, did dear did deceive yourself. Anyways, I'll come. I'll come, but I'm just trying to look for someone that will stay at the shop for me. Pending the days, I will, I'll be away. Wow. I like the sound of that. Baby, you know what I want you to do? I want you to calculate every dime you make on a daily, and I will take care of it. No, 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 no. You need the money for your other business, eh? for your other projects. I need to make my own money. <laughs> So, when are you coming to the village again? Well, babe, I can't really say because I'm still expecting you to visit. And I hope you'll come with the jacka. Now you've crossed the line. Good night and goodbye. Babe. Hello, babe. <laughs> Did I say anything bad? Amara's really changed, but she's the woman I want to marry. What is so important that, that you want to tell me this early morning? Can't you sit down rushing somewhere? Why didn't you tell me last night? Now what? that I'm rushing, you, you, you are telling me you have something Why to tell me. Why rush? You don't need to be rushed because now any morning with this market never ever open. Come on, will you tell me what you want to tell me? Now about that way you tell me last night, say you want to go city. I don't agree. Make a stay for your shop so that you go go to the city, go meet Uncle Leo. Uh -huh. Now what I want to tell you? Why did you change your mind? Are you not going for your father's work again? As many as are led by the Spirit of God are sons and daughters of God. God has shown me where it is written in the Bible that He that does not walk shall not eat. That means no food for a lazy man. So me, I won't join you for your business. May God know vex for me. Hmm? Really? So it is in the Bible? Yes, he came for 2 Thessalonians 3 11. So I want to help, I don't want to go help fire. I want to walk, make a job. But I go do one for you on one condition. Condition? Chaka, what is this condition? As she enter city, go see Uncle Leo. 
I no want make two of na commit sin. I no want make two of na do bad things so that God the punish you na. He no go punish me, John. I beg now, what I want? Hmm? Really? Hmm. I see. Eh, Ichaka. Don't worry about staying at the shop. Hmm? I already found someone that will stay at the shop till I return. So you can continue with your father's work so that God will not uh, punish you. Oh? You don't know say. You don't know say the person has seen and see this CEO. That's it, this thing from your shop. I don't want to not sin. If I see go sit down for house, not sin it be too. Eh? Not for your own good though. Okay, come well. on. Evelyn, I don't know why you won't let me go to the house at least. Confront that girl or talk to her over the phone. Of what use will it be to stage another fight? You caused all this. I told you but you wouldn't listen. Let me ask you, who wouldn't do the same thing in the same circumstance? Are you throwing it back at me? Wait a second. Are you indirectly telling me that you would have done the same thing if you were in her shoes? Yes. Didn't I tell you from the onset of the possible outcome of your actions? I told you, but your manipulative nature will not allow you to listen to me. Wait, I don't, are, you, are you for real? What on earth is wrong with you ladies? So why did you insist I should come here and see you? Why didn't you tell me this rubbish over the phone? Because I needed you to see the consequences of your actions. Yes, you brought this upon us, and only you will clean your mess up. Listen to me, Evelyn. I did not bring anything. Queen Eti did. Queen Eti did with her faith, sanctimonious and holier than Pope attitude. Yes, she thinks everyone around her is evil, and that is why she sneaks around others' misconduct, forgetting hers. Whoa! I can't believe you talk about Queen Eti like this. Huh? Oh my goodness, if you can talk about Queenette this way, what will be said of me behind me? Listen to me, there is no way you can compare yourself with that girl. Uh, you may be a naughty girl, yes, which you are trying to hide away from me, without knowing that I have already uh, know everything. But you are, you are a beautiful girl, uh, bubbling, uh, and also a happening girl, which every real man wants. Uh, uh, no man wants a, a monotony spirit as a wife or girlfriend. Kelvin, you are unbelievable. Am I not saying the truth? So for, forget about that, you little and little bit also. Uh... I knew it. I've always known that Evelyn is full of mischief. But I've been wondering why you've been living with her for years and you still didn't notice it. No, it's not that I do not know. She's my friend. It's just from the look of things. This is not one of her many mischiefs. Kelvin is responsible for everything that has happened. Here you go again. How can you possibly not blame her for this? How? Do you know you're the reason she's behaving this way because you practically support her of everything? Do you? It's not the way you see it, Leonard. Please. I'm always against all her wrongdoings. You know that. I even advise her to change. But you won't blame me for watching my best friend's back. Oh, really? Watching your girl's friend's back, really? Quinnett, let me ask you. Does she watch over your back as well? Because yesterday you came here and throughout our discussion, you were begging me, begging me to give her a second chance. And what did she do at your back? She was there making love with your boyfriend. Come on, Leo. I didn't say that. Then what exactly are you saying? Because I, I, I don't even understand you. Evelyn is direct opposite of you, which is a good and a virtuous woman. 
All she cares about is party, having fun, looking for men to lavish money on her. Now let me ask you, is that who you truly call a friend? Tell me. I'm not here to crucify her. I just want to let you know the way things are right now. But Leo, that shouldn't stop you from giving her a chance. If you choose, please. You know what, Queenette? Please. You're so unbelievable, okay? Please, I'm done having this conversation with you. I, I think you need a drink. You sure need one. Because I, I don't even understand you. I mean, how can you possibly support her on this one? How can you support her? I mean, how can you even possibly defend her on this? How? You understand. She was my best Take. friend. Best friend. And she's sleeping with your boyfriend. To her like that. Besides, she's preaching the word of God. Huh? She's not preaching anything. She's not preaching anything. This is an trouble itself. That's what they do. This person, violence boy. Violence boy. You know they change. Show you the hell. Did you just hear her? Preacher. Uh uh. But she responded to you the way you treated her now. Eh? Besides, you don't treat a girl like that. You should be a gentleman. Yes. You know they change. You know they change. I to thank you for what you talk for. That's what they do. I just think passing the whole they preach. I can't see this when they do. Say I like the sound. I see the person I like. Them. They make me come here, come and listen to them. I do but uh, Make mm -mm. you repent though. Make you repent. Kingdom of God, they are trying to make you repent. And you talk like a better person. Oh. Now fight now, now you be first. Number one. <gasps> Did you hear it, Chaka? Hmm? You need to repent though. You even know her name. Ah, who doesn't know Echaka? Amara's niece in this village. She's not troublesome. More. She just doesn't want anybody intimidating her. She goes around doing her business without looking for anybody's trouble. Thank you again. God bless you. Amen. You don't go lack anything. Amen. Blessing go be your name. Amen. No evil eyes go see you. Anything where you put your hand, my soul, so you go, they go, they fresh, they cool, they go. Amen. But see, like I say, now only you know me for this village. Uh -huh. Thank you. But as you know what me, make a come out, they go. But what I want to tell you, you say, my God, say, make I forgive you. And I don't forgive you everything where you do me. I don't carry anything from my mind again. I see no one change. Me, I don't change. God, they have the say, I don't carry anything for her again. I know they do any bad thing. Now, this is the way they play. Carry me, come here. Say, make a call in six one. You will be my friend. You come for sure. But no one, I see no one me. Look at the go now. It goes. Uh -huh. Don't cry. I understand, eh? I understand. Wipe your tears, okay? It's all right. No, no, no. Don't go now. Don't go now. Don't go now. Don't go now. It's okay. Uh -huh. Hmm. Ah, it's okay. Mm. Your sweet bread and akara. Your sweet bread and akara is here. Oh, customer, you know what I today? Eh, yeah, okay. Tomorrow. Your sweet bread and Akara. Your Akara is here, oh. Hey, customer. Okay. 
Oh, you beautiful damsel. Come on. Good morning, sir. Yeah, thank you. Can I have some of those stuff yourself? Oh, which one do you want, sir? I can have bread or the boat. If you want to with me, then I can cross and get to any type of your choice. Yes. Wow. That sounds so perfect. <laughs> yeah, perfect to the ears. Um, by the way, if what if I ask? What would it cost me to, you know, take a beautiful damsel of your caliber, you know, out of the scorching sun to a, a serene environment where we could actually just cool off for the whole day, yeah? Hey, excuse you. Wait, sir. I are you in any way implying that I should leave my business and follow you to Kulov? Um, honestly, that's that's not what I meant, yeah. Um, by the way, you you sound grammatically too good to be, you know, wrapped up in this local cocoon of a village, parambulating, hawking that's a local delicacy, or better still, tropical snack like we call it in London. Please, please, sir, stop calling my village derogatory names. Yeah. I don't even know the hem length you came from that compared to this village. And in that your lantern, don't you have cause? Oh my, oh my lady. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Trust me, forgive my manners once more, right? I was just kind of flabbergasted, you know, with your synthetic jugglery, you know, and let's call acrobatism. It was just a comparison to your intellectual, uh, that's, you know, our phenomenal village of Capone. I'm sorry about that. Sir, please stop whining me with this, your London Cambridge grammar. I, I, I think it will be relevant enough for you to tell me your name first. Oh my, oh my, oh my, you're right. Oh, okay, my, my name is Peter, Peter Okoye. I am the first son of Mazi Okoye. I don't know if you know the family. Oh, so, so you, you are uh, Chief Okoye's uh, son? Yeah. The one yeah. that said I've been in London for you. That's right, that's right, that's right. I've been in okay. London, no uh, my name is Njide, uh, Njideka. But they call me Njide for short. Oh, Njide yes. for short. That's nice. Nice to meet you, right? <laughs> you pleasure. know, this, this looks more like it. The African hospitality thing we get. How am I sure you didn't poison this food? <laughs> poison which food? Take your food, Joe. So you believe if I want to poison you, like if I won't kill you now, I will spend my money, go buy food. It's not possible. If I want to kill you, eh, start away, you go leave yourself like that, like pig, the snow. <laughs> now that time I will kill you. Call your food, Jare. See bats. Talking about another person sleeping. You know why I slept like that last night was because I took sleeping pills. Sleeping pills. At least I was awake while you were snoring. Wake up this morning, left the house with you still sleeping. So if killing you was the plan, of course I'm not going to spend my money. Take your food. Yes, I am happy. I heard the most assuring and encouraging words of my life today. Anyways, thanks for the food. Let me go inside to eat it. Okay. Wait, let me understand you very well. Are you telling me that he paid for everything? All your market? It's not just that. Ha. He said I should share it to everybody around the Megani village. And he even bought drink for them to step, uh, step it down. I remember you told me he lives in London and they made us believe that London people are very stingy. So how come your own is very generous? My sister, so I thought, until we went out for chilling 
and um, mm-hmm. he told me that he lived in London for 10 years, but now he lives in US. Hmm. So yes. you went to chill with him? Mm. Before Uncle, who no like better thing? <laughs> Before you just say a better eye person, they use uh, carrier car and bread and vill- uh, for this village. Now suffer be that one now, you don't know before. Hey. So now I don't turn to suffer. But now person talks in a calling and hobby. Because if you don't see man now, you don't turn to suffer. I know say if he if he propose to you man, you go accept. <laughs> Babe, slow down now. Eh? Who is even talking about proposal and acceptance? You wife, save that one, no day my mind. <laughs> Besides, his big, big grandma never let him talk go that side. Eh? Hmm. That one, no even day my mind. Mm-hmm. Come, they go house. I don't escort to rich man, they go house. Uh, eh, eh, wait, 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 you are not going anywhere. Uh, you know, they go anywhere. See, you need to answer me. Oh. <laughs> I can see love written all over your face. And today, since I know you, I have not seen you smile like this before. So, you need to tell me. See. Are you already having feelings for our Londoner? Avi, is it Americana? Tell me now. I'm your friend, though. Shabi, they don't send you, Avi. Tell me. Am I not your friend? I bet when they go house, I know they tell you anything. But tell me, who don't like Betati? I bet when they go house, see, you like gossip. You'll be correct, babe. Hey, 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 You can say that again. Yes. <laughs> See, I am blushing right about now. But the cocoa is, if they don't love you for who you are, God is going to bring someone who will love and respect you. Oh, yes. Um, My roommate is here. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay, I will talk to you later. I'll call you. Okay, bye. <laughs> Babe, you've not dressed. I mean, who's this person that you've been talking to for the past weeks now? You're always on phone. Eh? Who be this guy where they bust your head like mm. this? <laughs> you know, love they say is truly a beautiful thing when the vibe match. Yes, and the problem is I don't love him as much as I love Leonard, and that is why I've not been giving him full light. <laughs> So all this stuff where you talk now and I wash. Ah, uh-huh. evening. Repent mm-hmm. now. I am not washing anybody. Yes, he knows about Leonard and I. Like I told him everything, and he said he waits. That's my own. He should wait now. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See, Quinnet, I've learned the hard way never to put all my eggs in one basket. Yes, and that is why I have him. Should in case uh, uh, do not fuck up, I'll fall back to him. Like uh, my issue now is Kelvin. After since then, he's been behaving funny. He's not been picking my calls, acting so funny. Even after I told him both of us have made up, he's still acting strange. I want to go to his house and confront him face to face. Let me know what's wrong. Oh, this is serious. Yeah, that's a good idea. You should go to house and talk things out with him. But if things doesn't get better, that's when I will come in. Serious, I really feel bad right now. He's not taking his calls. I need to iron things out with him. Sure. Yes, I'm going Please to go there him. now. Okay. Let me go and dress up. All right, all right. All right. Nice to meet you. Kelvin, are you actually going to leave without seeing me? What the hell have I done to warrant this type of treatment from you? Is that all there is to love? Uh, listen, uh, Quinnet, if I did not want you to meet me in this house, I would have left before you arrived. I know very well that you have already left your house before calling me that you are coming to this place. And how on earth do you know that? Uh, because you are very predictable. Your self-righteousness has made your life so easy to an extent that even a common blind man can predict your next move. And that is not what I want in a woman. 
<laughs> this is very interesting. Me, Queenette, self-righteous. I'm not surprised hearing it from you. But the only contradiction is that you're just realizing it now. Someone is playing a reading that you're dancing to. But we'll get to the end of it. Have you seen it? Have you, have you seen it? Queenette, you are so full of yourself. To an extent that you don't know when to surrender to your foolishness. Rather than this pomposity of a peacock. Please save your energy. We all know the evil that comes with the sons of Adam. When they plow in the garden to graze on, and they rise with the air of conquest, then they go around looking for another grass to graze on. Rubbish. I thought you are here to sort it out. One will be thinking you are begging for clemency. Begging for clemency from who? From who, Kelvin? If your ego has blinded you from the truth, that it is your third leg that is leading you to action, then it is pointless dialoguing with you. Have you seen it? I wonder how many men will cope with your arrogance. Let me advise you. No man will like to have a second mother in a wife or girlfriend. Bring to her head down. Mr. Advisor, keep your advice to yourself. I'm a queen in my own kingdom. And the king that will like me will see me and have me. Suit yourself. You are a queen in your own kingdom. Well, let, let me see where it will lead you to. Honestly speaking, I didn't expect to see you like this. I thought this whole thing has ended. I'm not even sad because of the breakup, Jenard. I'm sad because I wasted all these years on nothing. On someone that does not even have respect for women. You know, I'm still wondering how come you didn't notice all those things. Of all the years you've spent with him. He didn't even give me a reason to suspect him. It was rosy, we had fun and all. But his recent actions now makes me think otherwise. Quinnette. Forget it. I can bet with my life because I am a guy. He's just using your quarrel with Evelyn, you know, to cover up for his new fantasy. That's what he's doing. That's exactly my point. That's why I told you the other time not to blame Evelyn for anything. My instincts even tell me that he's seen someone else. And the day that I catch both of them, turned out fire them. Honestly, honestly, Quinnette, I won't blame you for your reaction. I mean, you've been too faithful to this guy. He doesn't even deserve you. Please, cheer up, okay? So many thoughts are running through my mind right now. Do you mind to share? You know, no. a problem shared is half soft. No, it won't be possible. Don't worry, just please drop me off. Let me get going. It's okay. Yes. Thank All right. you. It's all right. Let me go fetch you water. No. She doesn't say you need water to cool. Hey, I know. But there's no way you will go and fetch me water. Eh? Hey, what if your father sees you? Biko, 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 biko. Ah, uh ah. -uh. What do you mean? Is it a crime for a healthy girl like me to go fetch you water? Mm. It's not like I'm going to the stream to go get you water. I'm going to my house to fetch it for you. Hey, hey, I'm a big man. What if your father sees you with a gallon carrying water in this village? He will skip me alive now. He will kill me. I don't believe that your father said so. Both of us were talking about this thing. All of a sudden, you went to the backyard, came back, and you're telling me your father... God forbid. What Mbaba. is God hey. forbidding? Mbaba. Eh? 
I told my dad that Onyema is not even around and he needed water to cook. So he commanded me to go fetch you water. I don't believe that. It's a lie. No, I don't believe it. No. Eh? He will roast me alive. I don't believe that. Okay. So, just hold on. Let me call. Let me call him. So that you get from the horse's mouth. Eh, he laughed at me. Jesus. Ah ah! Udoka! Peace! Why I like a woman at this man? Eh? You know, in, in London, where I come from, um, every woman is being treated like a queen. I mean, it's just a basic law of etiquette that if you break, you might be charged with Mr. Manor. Yeah, that means you might be going to jail for that. Is it? That, that's it. Why do you always talk more about London than America? Every time, London, every time, Rockman Palace. Oh, 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 my lady. You know, you cannot um, act quickly, comprehend until you maybe into vast to the breadth and length of both countries. You see, America has been structured in a capitalistic pattern, which makes it easier to, you know, make money, spend money. But then, if you want to learn about life in its purest uh, and modest form, then it has to be in London. Oh, maybe Paris. <laughs> You see? That's really nice. Yeah. I'm really learning a lot from you about this, these places. Oh, no, 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 my lady, don't say that. Uh, see, once the nuptial knot has been tied, she will go to have first own experiences of those countries. You don't have to be told, like no one has to tell you. She's going to go to those countries and, you know, have first own experiences. Huh? I bet you that, I promise. <laughs> Thank you for finding a village champion like me, worthy to be your bride. No, you don't sound like that, my lady. You see, beauty can be domicile in any one, irrespective of their geographical uh, location or social stratum. Do you get? So now I bet you walk majestically into your boat while I drive off. Leave. We won't yeah. at least come into the compound and see my room. Oh, no, no, no. That would be so ungentlemanly. And at the same time, contradicting the basic law of etiquette that I just talked to you about. So you just go in there. I will do that some more the time. All right? All right. Yeah. Can I get some help from you? Oh, why not? <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Right. All right. Bye. Safe. Uh, let me watch you walk. I said majestically. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. All right. This noise, eh? What is the meaning of this nonsense? Kai, why are you day like this thing? But now, now because of this thing, you stop this our our joy. I mean, you don't go join joy killers association. Come, will you shut up your mouth? <laughs> 
Shut up. Is it not the same Onyema that two of you are always insulting yourself, calling each other all sorts of names? Now, for the past two weeks, you both have combined efforts to disturb the entire village with your nonsense reggae music. Eh? We will not hear what they gain in this village, Okwaya. Okay? Sister, sister, my, why will you be saying this now? Is it not this same, this same music that converted arch enemies to best friends? Mm. Uh, uh, you know, won't give up to that music. <laughs> so you both don't have something meaningful to do to yourselves. You don't have anything meaningful to do, eh? You will not go and sell the things that you used to sell before. At least you to help your families, or even go back to school. Eh? Ichaka. Mm -mm. Go to school. You, you don't say that to my calling. No, you, you, you know. You don't say not my calling. What is your calling? Eh? Do you know how many things you have jumped into all in the name of this your calling? But yet, no one walked. No one walked out. So preaching is no longer your calling again. Hmm? Sister Ma, you don't know that music and preaching is the fastest way to convert someone. No, tell, no, tell them now. You know what I'm saying? All these choir members, now then they go heaven first before pastors. Because now then they sing, sing. Sing yes, praises, man. worship before God go come down. You know, people, people where they play guitar. No problem. Be there talking rubbish. Your pastor has been looking for you everywhere. I didn't know you were here. I told him that you are at uh, Oyema's house. Why now? Why kill you there? Huh. Why did you tell him my movement? Eh, uh, Paduma, no worry. We go live there, we go preach them about love. Again. Onyema, Echi. Onyema, Echi. My name is Onyema, Echi. Nobody knows tomorrow. I cut off my face, my ears, my nose. I know sender. I cut off my face. Why are you looking this sad? How did the meeting go? Bad is an understatement. We've broken up. What? How could Kelvin be this heartless? How on earth did he break up with you? Let me call him. Babe, there's no need for that. Don't worry. I was the one that broke up with him. I saw the relationship was not going anywhere. So I had to end things with him. Why? No, Winnet, you know do this one well. You should at least try to calm the situation down. I understand. But still, see, you taught me how to be a fighter. And that's why I tried all the possible best to hold on to Leonard. I will plan going back to Leonard maybe tomorrow or next. So funny how things have turned. Just a few weeks ago, I was the one advising you on how to take things. But now look at you. You're the one telling me about how to handle things. <sighs> you see, I feel we deserve better. Yes, and that's why I want to go back to Leonard and see if we can work things out. I really love him. Baby, I wouldn't stop you. But I'll just advise you to be careful. Now, now my babe don't come. Ah, ah, my babe don't catch fire now. Come, you know you doing. I'm looking at tomorrow and next. Because I have a problem. I don't know if you're still not going to stay at the show as we earlier discussed. Yes. See, let me tell you. My guy only stopped you from hawking, not from helping good friends like you. I'm not talking about your grandma, King. I mean, look at you. You've upgraded. Look at your hair, your outfit. 
will you be like this and and still sell sell in the market it's not possible now of course by the way i thought you said ichaka is willing to help if you meet up with her conditions hmm. ichaka mm -hmm. who is ichaka that one that parades herself as Yvonne Chaka Chaka. Oh. Please, oh. The only thing Ichaka does now is to parade the whole village with that her uh, uh, former fighting mate. The both, both of them. They parade the village singing nonsense song. Do you know when I went to the house of Kolemoni? I saw both of them seriously singing and dancing. Uh, that's all they do. Oh, that is great now. Uh -huh. The music have made best of friends out of sworn enemies. I beg, they don't even say that. Well, forget about it, Chaka. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for helping me once again. Because if not, my shop will be locked till I, till I get back from the city. I'll thank be there for you because you are my dad and only friend I have in this village. <laughs> All right. Take this. I have something on fire. Please wait, wait, wait. All right. I hope it's about Chow. <laughs> Ah, Daddy. The way you're going with Mommy Wamaka's matter these days, I'm suspecting you. Come on, naughty you. I'm only extending a helping hand to a widow struggling. Is anything wrong with that? My pretty intelligent daughter. Hmm, <sighs> Daddy. I didn't say so. Even if my suspicions were to be true, I mean, there's nothing wrong in that now. She's pretty, intelligent, industrious, and moreover, she has a good character. I need a mother figure. What on earth has gone wrong with you, this troublesome girl? Was that why you ran to the village living your issues to me? I don't know what entered your mind, but it's not anything that you may have suspected. Hmm, Daddy, take a chill pill and relax. I'm the only daughter that understands you more. Even when mom was alive, she never knew you like me. I mean, I already say I agree to it, and it's okay by me. You, how, what? Get out of my phone. I can see you are out for mischief this night. Good night. <gasps> yes! I know my dad. His mind is there. I'm so happy. I'm so delighted. Yes! <laughs> Welcome to my humble abode. Wow. <laughs> wow. Your house is really big and nice. Thank you. So this is the beautiful house you didn't want to give me to. Hmm? I'm glad you like it. Of course I do. Now you can see I've not been hiding anything from you. Are you sure? Sure, I'm still trying to, you know, um, take off the painting. Yeah. Okay, it's going to be your favorite color. <laughs> <laughs> um, babe, let me just quickly take you inside. I have a meeting an hour time. Uh, okay. But I won't keep you waiting for long. It's alright. Okay.
to visit. So you are the village cheap slot that Leo has been cheating on me with. Excuse you? Ah. She even speaks nice English. Ah. Now I see why he packed his car somewhere. Just to hide with you in this house. Hmm? Eh, 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 eh. Look, just watch it. Because I will not have you insult me. Any more insults from your mouth. <laughs> I will so deal with you. Mm, rubbish. Ah! Don't leave yet. Mm, you, you. I don't have your time yet. And where do you think you're going to? Eh? No, where do you think you're going to? Eh? Yes. Did you push me? No, are you trying to stop me? You don't know me. I'm Evelyn. And what are you going to do, Evelyn? Ooh. What do you intend to do? She, she asked that question. No, that better question you ask like this. No, what do you think? I will show you why I am in worry. Are you trying to stop me? No, what do you No, stop me! No, what do you want to do? They don't tell you. No, why do you think? No, they don't tell you. Why do you think you're trying to worry? For mama, for Nemo, for mama. of your health. I told you my dad has spoken to the commissioner of police and officers have been dispatched. Eh? To where? To where now? Eh? The people that had the mind to do this might not even come from this village. What if they are taking him away? What if they are taking him out of this community? Hey, mama. Hey. I saw their faces and I saw all of them. But you saw them? Mm, um, they don't look like people who come from this village. Ew. Me, I, I, I know almost everybody from this village now. Not to worry. Okay? There are checkpoints at every village boundaries. Eh? And because of all this insecurity, and as message has come from the commissioner of police, I'm sure something good will come out of it. You, you even heard it from the DPO, right? Do you trust them? Yes. I know something will happen. Do you trust mm. them? Yes. They are just mere, mere words of encouragement and you know it. You know it. So, my Why son. Do you oh. Why do you think it will happen? My son. Oh. Don't worry. Nothing. Nothing will happen. Yeah, I'm not saying these people are not going to escape. They're not going to. If I make a go, my pastor will go pray. Pray, baby. Come back. Pray, baby, no one pick up. I'm not crying. I'm going to make my father. 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 Amen. Amen. Amen.
Baby, I'm home. Baby. Baby. Leonard, thank you for being such a chronic, habitual, and serial liar. Your mad girlfriend Evelyn came here to fight me. Thank you for the humiliation and disgrace I received today. It is not your fault. But please, I beg you in the name of anything you hold sacred. Don't you ever set your foot in my father's compound or anywhere around me. Because it won't be funny if you do. Just delete me from your memory. I swear to God, I'll kill, I'll kill that bastard. Uh, why did you go and fight his guest in his house? What were you thinking? You went too far. Wow. What if the guy is not even his girlfriend? What if you talk? No, what if you talk? I feel like more people are I better be free. No, it's not for the people of this issue. That girl, why is he going to do that? Like the girl doesn't make me like they chose me. Nobody tell me that one. But even if she's his girlfriend, as you think, you know that he is not even fully back to you. You know our plan now. And you take it easy so you can get him back fully. I should take it easy. No, when I take it easy, when, when I open my tooth, I just say my man won't fall inside it. I got to, I, I got to do something like that. It's not possible. I got to save her from the truth. <laughs> terrified and speechless at you so if Evelyn had not run into the house I had not stopped you you would have beaten her up no beating her up is the least I would do so you can actually lay your hands on a woman I can't lay my hands on any human not to talk about a woman but you see this one I will never forgive your girlfriend I won't forgive her for this one. I will make sure she pays dearly for this. Please. I won't forgive her. Please, don't take it to that extreme. Calm down. Take it easy. You don't understand, do you? Don't tell me to take it easy. You don't understand the enormity of what this Jezebel has done. She just proved Amara everything. Everything. And, and I know I've lost my woman. I've lost her forever. You know, you have not. I will talk to Amara for you. Please take it easy. Even if it means accompanying you to see her. And do you I will think, tell her the truth. Do you think Amara that I know will listen to you? Do you? Do you know how long it took me? For her to come back to me? Do you know? 
Maybe I need to send the voice note she sent to me for you to listen. Then you will understand. Then you understand that I've lost my woman. Oh my God. Oh my God. I, oh my God. I swear I won't forgive her for this and I will not. Take it easy. Oh God. Oh God. Oh my God. I've lost my woman. Take it easy, please. Everything will be fine. Oh my God. Please. Calm down. <laughs> Seriously, my, my brain no feel sensitize this at all. Eh? Selonia had get serious girlfriend for city. You yeah, are here speaking big, big grandma. <sighs> Why your friend has been fooled? She has been fooled by a serial liar. Kai. <laughs> God, this, this is really unbelievable, eh? That innocent looking guy. What's going to happen to you? <laughs> she get accident. Oh, why she can't get accident now? Why she can't get accident now? What's going to happen to you? Now, this thing now. Tell me, you know what this is? Why you can't go to this thing now? Ah, nah, eh? Eh, Ichaka. She does not have any accident, no accident. Someone fought her in the city today. Hmm. Uh, hi! Today just be bad luck day. Bad luck. Just na 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 na. Then kidnap my friend Onyema. Now, even people want to kill my own auntie. Huh? <laughs> now, wow. What did you just say? Today na bad luck day. They kidnapped who? As you just they come like this. People just jump down from car, bam, grab on him like this. Waka come out. I did tell you. Hi. Hi. It's okay. Stop crying. Stop. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Ichaka, stop it! I don't have told you to stop this nonsense, Ichaka. Which nonsense? This is not nonsense, this is not rehearsal. And I do realize that today fit because my mind they tell me say so Uncle Leo fit come here. And if he come here, make me will fight. Diga, I'm out now. Ka, who told you he's coming here? He dare not come to this place. And he did nothing to me. This uh, bandage on my head is the nurse that just put it there. Mm. Nothing happened to me. And um, I'm gonna follow you. They go anywhere you they go. I go be your bodyguard. Because they fight, fight, they scatter, scatter you. You know what I mean now? Because me, I don't want me anybody fight you now. Begging in the name of God, it's getting late. Let me escort you more, Biko. Biko, no. You know nothing will make me leave you in this condition. Nothing. <laughs> but I have said I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. Nothing is wrong with me. You see? I'm fine. I'm fine. And you're still crying. Eh? Yeah. You're still crying. You know you're a big man's daughter. Let them not carry you the way they carried my son, Bikunu. Let me escort you. Mama, since not you know nothing will happen to me here. As they cannot touch you, they cannot touch me either. Hey. They can't. Uh, yeah, but. I don't even know if he's still alive or dead. Onyema. Onyema, can I be in a womb? Can I be in a... Onyema, Natasha, no Biko, come back home. Come back home. Come back home, Biko, Biko. Please stop now. Thank you.
Ijaka. Which nonsense? This is not be nonsense, though. This is not Rihaza. And they do Rihaza to their feet. Because the man they tell me is how Uncle Leo feet come here. And if he come here, make me will fight the girl I'm out now. Ka, who told you he's coming here? He dare not come to this place. And he did <sighs> nothing to me. This uh, bandage on my head is the nurse that just put it there. Mm. Nothing happened to me. Um, I'm going to follow you. They go anywhere you go. I'm going to be your bodyguard. Make can they fight, fight, they scatter, scatter you. You know what I mean now. Nah. Well, I don't want me anybody fighting now. Hey, you don't want to do I talk him. You see, you allow me to do this practice now. I'll go defend them as in the corner. Make me a rush him. Did you get my message? Please. Or are you daft? Please, uh, forgive me. I, I didn't mean to hurt you, please. Mara, I, I love you. I'm sorry, please. Please. It, it wasn't my fault. Please. Please, wait. Ah, Uncle Leo, you fall my hand. You fall my hand. You've met a scene before, but now you don't fall my hand. See, if you don't leave Hi. this place this minute, get out of this place. By the count of three, leave. Amara, please, listen to us. I know you do not know me. But I'll tell you the truth about everything that happened. Yes, it was actually Evely that did what she did to set Leo up. It's not his fault. Please. Amara, she's right. It wasn't my fault. Please. You know I love you. Please. Are you sure of what you're telling me? I can swear with my life. I'll give you the details of everything. Just give us a hear. Um. I'm sorry for the way I reacted. Let me go get some seats so that so I can hear the whole thing. I know they like this so, so soft mind now. I know they do this thing every time. to you. Get out! Get out of my compound. What? You did this to me. And I will do more. Get out! I don't want to ever see you. Ever again. Leave. I said leave! Taking my bath and dressing up. Guess what? What? My phone rang. My dad called me and said the DPO called him and said the kidnappers have been caught. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Hey! Yes. Hey! Who, who, what about my son? Um, he's fine. He's okay. I actually spoke to the DPO because my dad asked me to call him. Okay. And then he said the kidnappers, they are with him in the station. He said I should come and get it so that we can go together. Ah. Yes, yes. Okay. Let me dress up. Um, I'm fine. I'm fine. 
Uh, we can go like this. No need to hey, change. Hey, you don't think you can change and be okay? No, no, you no. You sure? Let me just lock my my door. Okay. Ah. Thank God. Hey. Thank God. My son. Yes. And your father. Mm -hmm. ah. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. My son is fine. You're sure? Look, look at you, Evelyn. Drinking hot tea this hot afternoon. You have been in pain since yesterday. Yet, you don't want to tell me this beast girlfriend who did this to you with her boyfriend. Baby, you be coming down. Come on. Shh. Be coming down. I'm in pain so really don't act to it. I didn't want to tell you because I don't want you to look as if I told my boyfriend and we both came to retaliate. Listen to me. Far from it, my love. These people need to be arrested. For Christ's sake, who, who, who beat off someone for coming to college is your adept? The guy even threatened to come to your house and beat you again. Which is the reason you ran to this place? Uh -uh. What do you mean the reason I ran to this place? Don't tell me you're not comfortable me staying around you. Or are you tired of taking care of me already? In just two days. I, uh, my love, I don't, I don't understand why you like twisting talk. I said the people that put your life in this danger need to be arrested or even sign undertaking. And you said uh, I, 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 I'm tired of taking good, 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 good care of you. What, 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 what do you mean by that? Baby. I know what I'm doing. Eh? Relax. I know what I'm doing. Nobody will. Uh, mm, oh God, I'm in pain. Nobody will eat my money just like that. Is it not me, Evelyn? Nobody will eat my money just like that. I will have to collect my money from them. And after I'm done with that, I will now sit back and draw my plants. Eh? Relax. I'm so I have done my best as a man. Remember. Oh, you didn't do. Na boko. Are you leaving? Eh? I thought you should be talking about how to go out and get me pizza and shower. Mm -hmm. I need pamper. I need to be pampered at this moment. Not a portion of beans. So shawarma and uh, pizza is more important to you than this undertaking. You saying the fiancé was uh, double dating and that the other girl is crazy? Yeah, that's what it means. Damn, that's totally unacceptable. Do you know if it were to be in London, he would be charged for bigamy? Yes, punishable by law. It's a punishable offense. Sweetie, are you ready to take me to her house? Or will you be here quoting American and London for me? Oh, come on, my lady. Come on, easy on me. Um. I am sure I told you that something brought me here before you came about with this enterprise of your friend. Yes, you did. Now, listen. I want us to fix a date. Yes, a date for me to go and see your people. So that we can, you know, cement this, our relationship, the customary way. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you so much. <laughs> so right now let's go somewhere and you know have a good time. All right. I like how you smile. <laughs> You look good. I 
I mean, I didn't know it would fit you this well. <laughs> Plus, I didn't even know your size. Thank you so much for the dress. I love it. Thanks. No, stop. I should be the one to say thank you. Um, I mean, I'm so sorry for such level of embarrassment. I'm terribly sorry. No, please. You should stop. Stop feeling guilty. It's not your fault. It's not her fault, too. Because I can feel her pains. You see what your stupid friend has cost? I promise her she'll pay dearly for this. She'll pay. Do you not know? You shouldn't put yourself at that level at all. Please. You should show her that you're not from the gutters like her. Real men don't go about flexing muscles with a lady. It's so debasing for a real man. Please you know, don't do that. You know, Gwyneth, you always have a way of dissuading someone from hurting your friend. Hope she does the same for you. You don't understand. Evelyn may be mischievous and unpredictable, but she's always got my back from the beginning. Do you know that I should be going? Let me see if she's back. It's okay. Just wait. Let me let me drop you off. Okay. okay. Drop you. All right. Thank you. My friend, this your ring is beautiful. Thank you. Hey, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> Congrats. Congratulations. Thank you. But please leave this for big, big grandma. Yeah. Which big grandma again? Yes, now, but. To tell you, that dude knows what he's doing. I don't know what they do. Exactly. <laughs> Just look at your ring. Let me bust your bubbles. Tell me. My introduction has been fixed two days after. Yes. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Hey. <laughs> this is good news. This is good news. Of course. You know you're going to be my shape. Of course. Of course so now. Who else wants to? <laughs> It don't happen, no. It don't happen, no. It don't happen. Sister. Ah! You know what did I tell you? It's your you know, My friend. My friend don't hear man a prince. In fact, today now the happiest day in this village, in this world. On your man a prince. See, what is be prince? On your man a king for their village. Eh, eh, Ichaka. Ichaka. You can see that when you came in, we were having a very important discussion. Hmm? So can you carry this your useless joke? Can you take it to your room? It can be joke. Not be joke, oh. I be the day you say them kidnap on him. Now those people will kidnap and they don't confirm and say they go carry on him and go in village. Go crown and king. Say now waiting their juju talk. So now on him and a king. Ejaka, what are you saying? <laughs> Wait. I sure know that Onyema is not the biological son of Madame Wakama. So, tell it, I know, I know too well. But, mm -hmm. not from this village, I'm not sure. Mm. Yes. Now, so they see him. Now, so be twice, see him. I'm shocked you now. Now, so they see him. Oh. They talk saying that King Gimbi. See him. Say he no be from this village. He no come from this village. Now, they don't think I'll go back from the village where he come from. And they are people on Yema. My friend, will you shut up? Shut up and go inside. Chineke na de wami. My friend, King Dogu. Happy ass. Igbo Dogu. Amina mo. Amina. Chineke na de wami. You were saying something about their shape. Yes. You go to the market and buy things for their shape. You were spotting. I cannot wait. Ijaka. Will you go to your room? I mean, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere anymore. I will never move. I mean, I'm not going out from this place. So. Yes, because they're the ones that rejected me and threw me to the bush. According to them, I, I was a cause child. That's why they threw me inside the forest. I me, mean, I'm not going. No. If not that, that the oracle was, was angry, they will not look for me. They would have left me there to die. I mean, I'm not going back there. My son. No one can fight the will of the gods. You will have to answer the call of Mama, your people. I'll fight that will of God. I'll fight him. Yes, I'll fight him. I told you something had happened to me that I, and I died. Will they be looking for me? 
Would they be looking for me? No, would this issue now come up? Eh, hey, let them tell me. They have sense. You know, I've always told you that it is divine arrangement. Your destiny cannot be denied by anyone. Hmm. So, Onyema is actually a prince. This is awesome and amazing. Is it? You know, from that night, I saw him helpless and lifeless. I've always known that there's something extraordinary about him. I've been scared of one thing. Scared that one day he will leave me. And that day has come. I'm not going to talk this guy now. I'm not going to talk this guy I'm not going to leave. I'm not going to move. I'm not going to move. I'm not going to leave anywhere. I'm not going to go. Don't say things like this. I even think it's a way of lifting you up to royalty. Yeah? And besides, you won't be known here again in life. In talk. In talk. Daddy, this is so refreshing. Mama will now be royalty. I mean, Oyama will not leave her alone. She's not like that. Did she say she will go with him to Umu's community? No, but she may change her mind. I mean, she and Onyuma are so bonded that you needed to see how she was all through yesterday till this morning before Onyuma was found. She will bond with you when Onyuma leaves. Yes, Papi, I heard that clearly. Hey, this naughty girl, what did you hear? Exactly what is in your mind, Daddy. You know I'm your daughter, right? And I know exactly what you're thinking. I am solidly behind you, Daddy. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> okay, Daddy. I love you so I love you. Love you. Mm -hmm. I don't really feel I don't feel like letting you go. Yeah, I know, right? Well, you see, what needs to be done, must be done. I need to go to Abuja and sort out some stuff for those big eggheads, you know. And then I'll return back to my African treasure. <laughs> you see, after we must have walked down the asset, I am going to take you out of this village to Miami. <laughs> I know you like the sound of that. <laughs> it's sweet to be shy. I know. <laughs> I'm going to miss you, my lord. Yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna miss you too, right? You see, if we were to be in London, I would have probably taken you out for a horse, right? Yeah, we would have just ridden all the way to Buckingham Palace for, you know, sad sitting and all those stuff. <laughs> oh, don't worry. <laughs> uh -huh. Just come and be going before you miss your flight. All right. Yeah, you know, if if you were to know how to drive now, you would have just, you know, driven me to the airport and then bend the car back. But nevertheless, when I come back, you're going to start off with your driving lessons, all right? <laughs> That's my girl. Come here. <laughs> I'm going to miss you. Miss you more. Yeah, you'll be safe, all right? All right. I'll be back in a jiffy, all right? Same trip. All right, Bye. baby. Now walk majestically, let me watch you. You are a true daughter of Igbo land. And you know what that means. Our land is in great danger because the rightful heir is not seated on the throne. We are begging you to please talk to him. As we are here now, our people are dying in great numbers. Adurwala. Adoma. 
Easy wine. Please, we are begging. The wicked woman that caused this problem on her son are all dead and gone. Ofo is still killing and killing. Please, we are begging. Well, that's a full moon, sir. I have read what you said. I've uh, spoken to Onyema, but he refused. As a matter of fact, that's the reason he ran away when he saw you people. You are the mother he knows now. It is only a true mother who knows the heart of her son. We are begging you to please talk to him. I'll try. I'll try to talk to him. As for the boys at the police station, there's nothing I can do about that. Too. The matter is not in my hand at all. Yes, they told us that it is uh, one chief. The chief they call the commissioner is the only one who can release them. They said that. But we are still begging. Though these boys did it in a wrong way, but it is still not their fault. It was an errand gone in a wrong way. Please, somebody should help. Because. Well, I'll talk to my father about it. But that means you people will sign an undertaking that nothing will happen to Onyema. Who is mad to touch the king after what has happened to him? Please, address him as Igwe whenever you want to talk to him. Biko. Well, um, I've heard everything you said. And I'll try my best. But I'm not promising anything. Onyema has a mind of his own. We thank you. Uh -uh. Queenette, this is serious. How long have you been like this and how come you didn't tell me? Two days now. I thought it was going to subside, but it has not. Then why didn't Evelyn get you some drugs or take you to the pharmacy or something? It's over a week now I haven't heard from her. She's not even taking her calls. Did she mention where she went to? No, she did not. But there's this guy that she's seen of recent. I think she must be in his house. She must have gone there to hide. Then how come you didn't tell me about this guy? It's okay. Anyways, um, have you had your shower? No, not I need yet. To, you need to get some medication, okay? Please get up. Can you stand? Can Take it easy. Take try. it easy. Take it easy, okay? Sorry. 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 Choco, you're welcome. My paddy man, my paddy man, Igwe, Igwe, my paddy man. Oh, Eh? Is this you? This is. 
is brief, live and direct. Hey! Ha! Ha! I don't tell you. I don't tell you, say, my friend, now nah, I don't talk to big man. You go. So they talk to your party, make her they talk to my party. Who be your party? Party man. Good day, good day, sir. Uh, Oyema, is, is this your brother? This is Izuchuku, the son of the honor of Omo's kingdom. Wow. Although he lives abroad. Hey, yeah, you're welcome, sir. Thank you. My How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Hey! My party man! Talk to your party, make a talk. Who be your party? No time for your meal. Yes, we, we have serious thing today. So I come pick your meal, they go, they make the match. No, I make a go dress now. No, no need for dressing. Clothes plenty for them. Eh? You see ya? I know them. You see ya? Oyema, what's going on? I don't understand. Pity you don't understand. Try to understand and I say, life don't change for Oyema. Oyema don't become king. Me, Nana, be paddy. You don't understand. Yes, she's right. What uh, His Majesty here is saying is that we have lots of activities in the palace. Yes, and he insisted that nothing will go on except we come to get his best friend and his foster mother. Yes, and then I'm also inviting you with his permission. Of course, because she's part of our royal train. Let's go. So you make a people like this. No, they go. They are not milk. No, this is no. And they go. After you go, to come. Ah, uh -uh. Ichaka. So you're leaving me? I'm going to leave you now. Bye-bye. Eh. Hey. Oh, yeah, now. Be careful, oh. Don't go and fight, oh. Oh. Bye-bye. <laughs> hey. Hey, please, take care of them, oh. All right. Uh -huh. All right. Yema, now a king. Oh, dear. <laughs> You know, I've been thinking. Okay. I don't really think it's a good idea for you to visit that guy. Why? I mean, you're barely done with your treatment. I believe you're not physically strong for that. I really need to go to be sure that the relationship is over. Because I don't want when I've moved on with my life now, someone will come and start claiming what is not. I really need to be very sure. Queen Knight, I really don't understand you. I, I thought you said you were the one who walked out of the relationship. Going back to that guy may seem like you're forcing yourself on him. You know, all those things were done in anger. And you know how men are. 
really need to be very sure. If it's over, I'll just hand over the house keys to him and move on with my life. Quinnette. Yes? I understand how you feel. I know it's hard to leave someone when you're truly in love. Though sometimes the people we love don't always deserve it. But I want you to be careful. I can't stop you if that's what you want. I'm even having a feeling that something is going on with him. So I really want to go there, give him an unannounced visit. So I can be clear in my mind that yes, this is what I'm... Let me even see the person that's captured his heart. It's okay. If that's what you want, that's fine. Okay. It's alright. Let me just drop you off because I'm late already for work. Okay, that's for me then. Thank you. Alright. to see you too. Uh, where is uh, Ichaka? Ah, I thought you came with her. Well, Ichaka is not coming back again. Or at least anytime soon. Uh, what do you mean by that? Has she become a, has she suddenly become an indigenous of Umuze community? Well, sweetheart, you can say that again if you choose. You see, the point is the matter is more complicated than you think. Oh well, yes. But the point remains that uh, his Majesty will not be crowned if he's not fully married. Uh, yes. Uh -huh. So he needs a wife. So what has that got to do with Ichaka? He has professed love to Ichaka. And they seem to share the same idea. Eh? Uh -huh. Yes. What nonsense love is that? Eh? Uh -huh. You don't like it? What does Ichaka know about love? Ichaka is not even up to 18 years. See, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm not comfortable with this at all. Listen, just... It's not even up to two months that they reconcile from being sworn enemies. So how come they're already professing love to each other? Hey, hey. See, sweetheart, at this point, your worries and your fears, they don't add up. Because he is now king. Yes. And as king, elders of the community will do everything traditionally possible to protect the king and his family. Huh. I'm worried. Ichaka is a small girl. What does she know about love? Come eh? on, come what on. kind of problem is this? Come on. Relax. Hey, God. Relax. Let's, let's, let's talk about us. Hmm? I came here for you. How? I don't understand. Come on. Can't you dare pretend for me? You see, I see the fire in your eyes. Just time you look at me. Or even any time we talk on the phone. Listen, you will not tell me you don't share the same feelings with me. Well, I don't know what to say. I need to get back to the shop. I just came back to pick up something. All right, so maybe some other time. Oh, nothing. Don't worry. You see, the answer is affirmation. The shop, I will take you to the shop. Of which you may not go there again after today. <laughs> Don't worry, come here. Come here. You want to take me to the shop? I'll take you. Jesus Christ! Evelyn! So you've been the 
one all along. Can you imagine? Baby, why didn't you lock the door? You're a bastard and you must pay for this. Kelvin! So you're this cheap? What lies did she tell you that made you fall for her? I hope she told you that she went to Leo's house to fight his girlfriend and they beat her up. That was what made her run to your house that day. Hope she told you that. What? Evelyn, is this true? Why am I even listening to this rubbish? Both of you suit yourselves. But Leonard must know that you're here. Rubbish! You, you, you know it's not true. You, I, 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 you know. Don't touch me. There's no how I will. You see what I've been telling you? I've been telling you that this Evelyn of a girl is capable of hurting anyone, but you wouldn't just listen to me. Now look at it. She betrayed you. She betrayed you. Now you're hurt. How could I have known? How could I have known that she could be this callous and shameless? Even that pig goat of a fool that I've been loyal to all these years. Because you've been defending her. Yes, that's what you've been doing. All you do is defend this girl. Now look at it. Now look at it. She slept with your man. Listen, Quinnet, honestly, just take it easy, okay? I know you love this guy, but I warned you. Even though you can't cry, you see why I practically warned you not for you to visit him? I told you. But you wouldn't listen to me. How would you say something like this? If I had not gone there, how would I have known that something is wrong? Honestly, I must get my own pound of flesh. I'll arrest that bastard. I'll arrest her. You have anything you want to do to both of them. You can do it. Don't care anymore. Just take it easy, okay? I know you can't cry. These rappers are so beautiful. Eh? I know. I knew I really tried though. Eh? What will he do that will be too much for your queen mother? Eh? Anyways, why did you run and leave the palace? You. Why did you not stay? Why did you come back the next day? Um, I only escorted you there now. Moreover, I'm not a princess, but a queen mother. My dear, no matter how good almost the people are, one day they will remind me that I'm not from their place. So I decided to come home to live my simple lifestyle. Ah, that makes everything perfect and easy for me thank god you came back home mm -hmm. i don't understand what do you mean perfect and easy for you um i'm not supposed to tell you this but i'll gossip it my daddy loves you and he wants to marry you Time to go. Don't come and insult me. Go, 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 go. <laughs> That's the spirit, my new mommy. That's the reaction I'm expecting from you. You know, the first time I saw this idea to my dad, this was the exact reaction he gave to me. Yes. Yes, and I have a new mommy. Yes. Peace. I'm so happy. Peace. Just go home. 
Mara, you see in this life, eh, nobody should lose hope at all. See, you were happy for me the other day. Now, you still have overseas boyfriend as well. You see? <laughs> yeah? My dear. Seriously, I'm happy for you. I know even now as it didn't take happen. Honestly, as the Bobo show like this, now so my body became vibrant. <sighs> hey, hey. Um, now that time I know, say, I don't fall in love. And do you know the funny thing? Um, I didn't know that this guy fell. Thank you. <laughs> You're looking so sharp. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine. You know, my friend and I were just talking about you. Oh, really? Yes. Hi. I hope you're telling her good things about me. Of course. Okay. Njide, mate. Um, is it Chuku? Njide, how are you? Fine. Good to see you. Same here. <laughs> so what you guys up to here? Nothing. We're just, you know. Having girls just. Okay, okay, that's wonderful. And thank God your friend is here. You know, there's something I've been meaning to do. But the fact is, that I don't really know my way around here. Mm. So I was actually looking for a very nice place. But what do you want to do? Your friend is going to be a witness to it. I hope there's no problem. Now come on, relax. <laughs> relax, it's nothing. So you guys just give me. One minute. Are you sure? Let's relax. Okay. <laughs> I am. say is that my few weeks of stay in this village you have shown me nothing but love you have proven to be a virtuous woman I'm glad I met you yes and to tell you that you're the most beautiful woman in the whole world please I want you to complete me Amara, please marry me and make me the happiest man on earth. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! I'll marry you! <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god. Oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah! <laughs> That's for you. Oh my That's for goodness. You. you like it? I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh yeah. Come here. Oh my god. Thank you, thank you. Mm. I love your smile. <laughs> Come here. <laughs>
I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for coming. The traffic was too much. Is this how you will be keeping your mom waiting? And by the way, why did my husband not come to carry me himself? Huh? Sweet mom. Uh, next time, I will not keep you waiting, okay? As for the second question, your husband has to answer that question himself. I could not use any set in Korea. Not see, girl. Let's go. Yes, 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 let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I am done with you. You are evil. Evelyn or whatever you call your name. You are possessed. Yes! You are evil. I am so done with you. I don't want to see you anywhere around you me. I am mad. Get this Listen. Kevin, you are mad. Oh, you want to use me and dump me. It will not work for you. So after you said I was your spec, that I was your vibe partner, so the vibe don't come out, eh? I know they get anywhere. Uh, I know they... No try. Le listen, listen to me. Yes. No try with me. Oh. You used to be my spec. That was then. Now that I have realized the kind of woman being you are, mm -hmm. you are no more qualified to be my spouse. Stop! It, it, come on, sit See, don't, don't Hey! Eh? Kelvin! See! If you try and, eh? Listen. If you try and with me. Listen. Eh? My generation will that away. Don't the fire you. I mean. Fire by your generation. Eh? Don't the fire you, fire ah. So that me, okay, you don't say I, Evelyn. I, Evelyn. I'll be worried and be need combined together. I know. So you don't know. I don't know. You no. don't know. <laughs> you don't grab the seed. You don't grab the seed. Keep my hand back. You don't grab the seed. Drop her. <laughs> I Drop my handbag. Keep on. Ah. Keep on. You don't. You don't hold the seat. You don't hold it. You don't hold the seat. I go. You can't go carry my bag. We don't have it. If you do anyhow, you go see anyhow. I do. Nami and you. Have it. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. If you do anyhow, please. Nami, na Ibrim. Eh? Eh? Sorry. You want you? Ah. Have it. Have it. You don't grab. You don't grab the second seat. That's why I go grab him. In a person in generation, you go like this. If you do anyhow, eh? I go bust you. Ah, I don't bust your generation. No boss, no boss. Yes. No boss. They move. No boss. You know what I mean? No. You won't mess with me. No. no. You don't grab your ass. You don't grab your ass. Why are you staring at me like that? Like you've not seen me before. I actually came here to find out something from you. Riches. Do you remember that day that I came to plead with you on behalf of Evelyn? You made a statement and I wanted to find out from you. Are you positive about that statement you made? Rich statement. Refresh my mind, please. Really? Okay, you know, I've been thinking, if I've been the one in such dilemma, I don't think it will have been the same thing. But I wanted to know, from your statement, were you saying it from your mind, or you under that duress? <clears throat> Quinnet, you know, when I actually made that statement, I was absolutely positive then. Though we were taken. So now that we've both been served breakfast, what then? Both single. Yeah. We're both single. And I still care about you. 